Hello, howdy lab partners. Uh, welcome to the Sunday stream. And back to the 90s. Yes. Today we're going to be painting some retro marines uh, as part of the 90s marine challenge by uh, Darren Latham, who's been yes. putting this thing on. Uh, yeah, sorry we're a little late. Uh, Bartok was in here and we couldn't get him out. He he's... would not get off the laptop. Yeah, he's and he was, like... he's the reason yeah. we're late. Yeah, <laughs> wasn't me. No. It's never me. Uh, yeah, so we're going to jump right in. We're going to talk about um, what we're inspired by, like what's what's this whole thing we're doing. So let's go to... Inspired. Inspired. <laughs> so um, you might have seen this uh, if you're in the 40K space, mm -hmm. you know, on Instagram. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Basically, um, Darren Latham, who we've actually had a, we, we've had him featured, featured on, the, on yeah. the show before. <clears throat> I think uh, it was his flames that we did for yeah, the Gastus. Right. Yeah. That's right. Um, you know, awesome painter. He's putting on this 90s Marine Challenge. And basically the idea is that we're going to paint some retro Marines. Um, so yeah, there's all the information if you want to partake. Um, but what we're gonna actually going to do now is we're going to show some, uh, what some other people have been doing. Yeah. Yeah. Um, also, we wanted to showcase all the different factions. Yeah, so uh, for those of you don't, who don't know, this is, these are some like old, old school, really crazy Space Marine schemes. Yeah. Um, for those of you who know what I paint, this is actually what my entire army is based off okay. of, is uh, the salamanders who are the bottom, middle, whatever. You'll see me paint it. Oh, with like the... the designs all yeah. over, like the stripe, the yellow the and black. Stuff. Yeah, okay, cool. And Meg, you chose one of these to I paint as well, did. didn't you? I did. I chose uh, the Raptor Legion blizzard suit because yeah. I, I like the spots. Yeah, <laughs> it's just gray and black with, with spots. spots, so hey look, that's, yeah. Should be, yeah, these are all pretty crazy. Um, but yeah, so we're not the only ones doing this, so uh, we, you know, we went around checking out the 90s Marine the Challenge grams. hashtag, yeah, and uh, we're going to show you what some other people have been working on. Uh, yeah. Pretty. So this is Tabletop Mini Showcase. Uh, we found him by, you know, the uh, the hashtag. He actually has his own YouTube channel. Yes. Um, so you should check it out. But it's the same name, Tabletop mm -hmm. Mini Showcase. And yeah, uh, great looking retro marine. Who is, what chapter is this? Can I don't... You tell by the colors? You, you know, I thought it was Dark Angels. I don't think it is, though. It might be... It's not mentors. I'm like, either. oh, it's the C3PO faction because <laughs> he's got a little red kneecap. <laughs> oh, <laughs> yeah. Where's his red arm? Yeah. Uh, yeah. Actually, I'm not. I'm not sure. Actually, he probably has it. Okay. He probably says, but yeah. Uh, I can't I'm say. Check it on the page. Okay. All right. Uh, hey, this looks familiar. This looks like something we do. <laughs> yeah. So this is uh, AC Miniatures. Um, he's doing a Legion of the Damned. Very retro scheme. Mm. Uh, really, probably one of the most iconic. You know, is it? Yeah, 90s. Okay. It's, I mean, it's very 90s skull and flames. It's like... Sure. I'm 13-year-old. I'm the 13-year-old boy, and I love this. Yeah. I love the flames, man. Yeah, super good. Never get old. No. And uh, I think this is the last one. Yeah, France, one more to show you guys. Yeah, Ghost Paint Killer. Uh, listen, this is like <sighs> a twofer. We got a Wu-Tang reference, which is very 90s. <laughs> yes, that's true. And, uh, yeah. What... Can you tell what faction this is by yes. looking at it? Okay, because I can't. <laughs> so this is uh, Celestial Lions. Okay. Um, if you read the books, uh, Emperor Spears, they're, they're a big part of that. It's probably one of the better 40K books. Okay. Um, yeah, super cool. I just want to point out this non-metallic metal. That's it's so good. so, so well executed. Oh, my gosh. Uh, yeah, and this is, you know, this is a work in progress. This is, like, not even finished. Right, so, uh, right. Yeah. This is from a little video he put up where he's showing his process. So you should go and follow all these people on Instagram. Yeah. Yeah. Um, they're great painters. Please do. Yeah. And yeah, so just once again, 90s Marine Challenge. This is what we're doing today. Yeah. All right. All right. So. Should we show where you're at with yours? Because I think you're you're much further along with me yeah, yeah. than I am. Uh, yeah. Yeah, yeah. So. The Lumex real quick. So. So this is where I'm at. Um, you know. We don't really like to airbrush in here because it's kind of a small room, so I went ahead and did the airbrushing stage beforehand. And uh, yeah, this is going to be my retro Rogue Trader era salamanders, and so Very what cool. I'm going to be doing is painting some uh, black, not exactly stripes, but some black camouflage over yeah. the top of him. And then if you want to throw yours up there, it's not oh, super, sure. super Mine's... exciting to look at not because really, it's no. just black and gray. But uh, yeah, this is gonna be your Raptors Legion in uh, Blizzard camo. Yeah. It? Yeah. I guess so. So you're gonna be painting some spots. Yes. Yes. Bunch of spots all day. 
And then uh, I'll try to get his beak done. I liked how he had a little like yellow. Beak. Yeah, a little yellow, like a little bird. <laughs> so a I'll little... do that. I think I'll get that far. The the free hand I probably won't get to finish. <laughs> a lot of dots to paint. Yeah. All right. Uh, we'll see. We'll see. And uh, yeah, if you're tuning in and you want to help us out, you can like, love, and subscribe. Yes. That would be helpful if you enjoy this that 90s content. That helps Although, us out the most. Yes. It won't always be 90s content, no. I promise. No. Uh, we have a lot of segments today and a lot of stuff to get through. We yeah. have memes. We have fan stuff. We have uh, our experience with the 90s. Yeah. What is 90s to us? What is 90s? What even is the 90s? And we have a poll going on. Yes. Yeah, I'm actually curious where that's at. I feel like I know where it's at based on our audience. Well, so far, grunge is winning. Wow, by quite a bit. A lot, yeah. Um, I'm a little surprised, but I guess... That depends tracks on with our audience, the age range of our audience, yeah. right? Are you the tail end of the 90s? Or are you the beginning of the 90s? Yeah, exactly. Um, so we're learning a lot about our audience right now and their age range. <laughs> they like Powerhouse grunge. Diva does not have zero any. Per, zero percent. That's, That's surprising. That's like Mariah Carey, Whitney Houston, you know, that, that yeah. type of stuff. I so. mean, no 90s hip-hop and like, rap, though? Really? I know. I'm like, Blackstreet was my uh, entire junior high experience. Yeah, yeah what's going on? <laughs> no diggity, man. Yeah. You guys are um, welcome to change your answers. Exactly. Oh, right. And, uh, you know, if you have any questions for us... Uh, super, super Chat Special. Yeah, we Super are, Chat Special. We are very close. We're actually, actually, those of you that are here get to get a little heads up. We are at 4,000 hours. Yes. We've hit it. But... There's a process. YouTube takes a minute to, like, catch up. It's very weird. Like, they report your hours that people have watched and then it's like they rescrub them and say okay this counts towards your yeah earning meter yeah so so we're waiting for that to catch up then they're gonna send us an email then we don't know what happens next yeah so we'll see and we're gonna keep you guys updated don't worry but for now you get to enjoy this super chat special yes which is just at us sorry i'm trying to look up my blizzard suit so i can have oh, it no. as a, i'm not just like on my phone <laughs> yeah uh if you have any questions for you know what actually you know what let us know what is when you when you think of the '90s? What is the first thing that comes to mind? Because yes. that's what we have. Uh, we have a whole well, segment about coming up that. later. Yeah, we want to know. And purposely vague, like it, just what do you yeah, think of when you anything. think of the '90s? Open, open-ended question here. Yeah. Okay. You can uh, at the Ooh. hobby collab for us. Um. Okay, I like this. Oh, look at the little raven head, or it's like a bald eagle. <laughs> oh yeah. Wait, why is it a bald eagle when they're ravens? Uh, you know, we've had this conversation. Oh, okay. We've had Sorry. this conversation. Not, not you and me. We had <laughs> okay. this chat, uh, this conversation in the Hobby Collab uh, Discord <laughs> chat. Um, we don't know okay. why. <laughs> it's base, it's like, that's very American, answer. too. Yeah. And um, yeah, you notice that's like their old, their new scheme is just like yeah. green. It's kind of boring. Oh, it's green? It's just a normal. They're, so this is like a retro scheme this is like the old scheme okay but uh if you I, look them up now it's just like green i why is it covered in polka dots by the way like what is the what's the significance of the polka dots i think it's supposed to be camouflage with but with a blizzard yeah you know if it's snowing maybe you wouldn't be able to see them okay um i, I this is, uh, no, I don't think anyone, I don't think Mar uh, Space Marines nor GW in the 90s really understood how camouflage works. So. Oh, that makes sense. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> so I'm going to go, I'm going to switch to this camera real quick just so I can yeah. show you what I'm doing. Um, I'm still getting set up. So here's a very bright yellow marine and I'm going to start with some camouflage or what, you know, what GW consider camouflage. Basically, we're just doing these little squiggly snake, little snaking, uh, marks um now i don't like to do exactly the way gw does uh, i tend to put my own little twist on it and that is i uh i add a little bit of distressing to the sides um but here there's, yeah. there's his leg that's where we're going little snakes cool yeah that's cool yeah i wanted to stay away from anything too difficult yeah. <laughs> um, but i but i wanted i also wanted a suit that wasn't just flat colors yeah um, and I was like, oh, polka dots. I can handle polka dots. 
Uh, let's see. Rudy Picardo says, Greetings from Oman, fellow hobby friends. I can only stay on for an hour or two, but wanted to share my... Well, that's great, because our show's yeah. only two hours. Yeah. <laughs> today is not a marathon, no, believe no it or marathon not. No marathon today. Um, but wanted to share my support to the Hobby Collab team and you. Hope all is well at your hobby space. Thank you, Rudy. Yeah, and yours too, even yeah. though it's, it's probably far, very warm. Far away from home. Yeah, we, um, <laughs> speaking of warm, we did a good job cooling off the studio today. Oh, yes, yeah, good. <laughs> yeah, we should be good for these two hours. Um, good to see you, Rudy. Yeah, good to hear from you. Yeah. Um, it's always nice when you're able to hang out with us. I know it's kind of rough. Yeah, the time difference is pretty big in a while. Yeah. Um, <laughs> Saray has his 90 shoulders going on. <laughs> yeah, I was like, yeah, you're good, Saray. So I was like, I didn't have a 90 shirt, and I'm like, you're, you're fine. <laughs> I'll be all right. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> um, Laura Brand, Meg, the hair is adorable. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> um, I was looking for hairstyles from the 90s that, that could work, and it was either like the Alicia Silverstone <laughs> clueless, like just yeah. straight. Straight and, down. Like, swiped or and I was like that's not as fun that's not as obviously 90s so uh, I went for this I don't know um tiny hair buns because that was a thing yeah I don't what do you that remember I you were like little I was a little baby so yeah. when I think of I feel there's a lot more long hair just in general uh-huh you know that kind of yeah. tracks with the grunge yes exactly yeah, yeah. um Shoot, I didn't actually do my hair like this <laughs> in the 90s at all. Like, no. I mean, when I was, we'll talk about, we have, like, a whole segment yeah. about this, but I was a kid, like, in the 90s, and I was a tomboy. I wore, like, big baggy t-shirts uh -huh. that, like, hid my body. I was just, like, not interested in any of that kind of stuff. Right. So, um, I think... I remember when butterfly clips came around in the 2000s, I was all about that. <laughs> so I was like, oh, I need to actually care about how I look. I want a boyfriend. <laughs> <laughs> and butterfly clips are the key, yeah, apparently. Yeah, butterfly clips. Everyone's wearing them. Um, yeah, it's like the opposite of, or it's like the my experience. Um, it like parallels the guy into Warhammer, uh, <laughs> but now I want a girlfriend, so I gotta give this up. <laughs> like, I gotta oh, give up. The... I need to care about my appearance. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I think, you know, when in the 90s, my mom was still dressing me, so... <laughs> yeah. I didn't really have a choice. Uh, I had, you know, very limited choices. Yeah. But you probably didn't care as much. No. I think that, you know, funnily enough, I think there is a picture of me with these in my hair. These little buns. <laughs> I, if we look, there's probably oh, one. Oh, yay. I'm sure Holly will find yes. them for us. Holly, uh, get to work. <laughs> yeah, I had, growing up, two sisters and a mom who did, uh, like, beauty and hair work, so I was a test bed, let's say. Yeah. My little curly hair. How cute. Oh, my gosh. Um, chat... Uh, what, are you guys taking part in this challenge? Yeah. Hey. Yeah. Yeah. If you, yeah, if you're taking part in this challenge, challenge like, Please. add us and let us know what you're painting. Yeah. Who you're painting. We want to know what your, yeah, what legions you're doing. Um, yeah. I had planned on doing a little bit of research on my raptor legion, and I did none. I did not have time. <laughs> <laughs> That's so, fine. Uh, I'll just make stuff up if people ask me questions. Yeah, I think that's. That's the smart thing to do. It's like, yeah. Yeah. Like, what are you going to do? Check? Exactly. Oops. I'm like, palette. Uh, why? I don't know. <laughs> I mean, you can, if you need the I black, don't. Go I for just, it. Go for it. Uh, I don't know what made me do that. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Uh, yeah, I'm still just doing my little stripes now. I'm trying to vary up the, like, the thickness of the lines. Mm -hmm. Not super easy. I might actually just grab a different brush. So I'm, like, forced to. Oh, yeah. I'm laying down my first layer of spots. It's basically like a, a hair lighter than this black and um, gray highlight you've given. Oh, yeah. Yeah, so I'm going to build up probably three or four. Small. Yeah, layers. like 
subtle changes because they're fuzzy. They look fuzzy in this picture that I'm looking at. Yeah. So I want to just, um, here we can. Oh, do you want to switch can, to yours? Sure. Yep. I mean, while I'm working on it, here's my little phone. It's kind of hard to see from here. You're not going to see any spots from this angle, but <clears throat> basically I'm trying to just make it look fuzzy as I come up from the black value. Yeah. So there's uh, the actual paint I used was uh, petroleum gray. Okay. Which, if you haven't used it, it's like a really good highlight for black. I often find that... Yeah, it looks nice. Yeah. I often find that when you're trying to highlight black, it's it's hard to keep that color. And mm -hmm. like if you highlight with blue, it looks blue. Right. But this petroleum gray is like, it's it still looks black even if you lay it on a little heavy. Yeah. But uh, it is, like, you can still tell it's not, you know. If you have actual black next to it, it's, like, pretty clearly different. <clears throat> Elijah Patrick says, happy 90 Sunday. Thank you. Yes, you too. Um, I'm glad we decided to do this yeah. <laughs> challenge because I love talking about the 90s. It was my childhood, you know. It's kind of fun. It's nice to be nostalgic. It's a good time to be a millennial. Yeah. <laughs> right? Yeah, in the 90s. Yeah. He was, yes. I guess. I don't know. Yeah. Um, but Maybe yeah, all just... that stuff is coming back. Kid, <laughs> kids are like, Gen, uh, Gen Z is like very into <laughs> 90s music and style. And I'm like, why are scrunchies a thing? <laughs> <laughs> why is that coming back? Is this what our parents the, felt like? The, the kids long <laughs> When for like the bell bottoms came back. Yeah. They must have the scrunchies. Wait, what were those things where you like, uh, I think they used a, they like snap bracelets? Yes. That's yes. I had those as a kid. Yeah. <clears throat> That'd be great. They'd like give them away as like fundraiser prizes. Like, oh, if you sell <laughs> one box of whatever this is, your first prize is a snap bracelet. Yay. <laughs> what would be yeah. the point of those? Was that, was that all? It'd be cool. Oh, okay. It's a, I mean, it's an accessory. It's like, what's the point of a necklace, you know? Oh, uh, yeah. Good point. Yeah. Come on, sorry. <laughs> I'm not. I'm not in. Uh, are, are the, are the, is Gen Z fiending for snap bracelets? That's oh, what I want. That's a good question. Is there anyone from Gen Z watching? <laughs> I would love to know. <laughs> um, my nephew is all about '90s alt rock. He loves it. I mean, it's and I'm cool. like, oh, this is great. Now I can <laughs> get in the car and listen to music with you and just enjoy myself. Um, I mean, I like new music too. There's some new stuff I like. Yeah. But um, it's always fun to be nostalgic. Yeah, I'm curious, chat. Add us, what is the most 90s song to you? Oh, yeah. We got 90s music on the brain here. Yeah, we were, I was listening to some driving down here, and I was surprised at how many didn't strike me as like, oh, that came out of the, really? That's a 90s right? song? Like, it doesn't sound like. Oh, that's a tough question. Yeah. The song that sums up the 90s. Yeah. Crazy. Um, I was listening to Now. Do you guys remember that album, Now? It was <laughs> like a collection of... That's what I call the 90s, yeah. Yeah. Well, pretty much. Yeah. Um, but I had the... F like, I remember when the first one came out. Now oh, really? Around like 100 or something, right? <laughs> yeah. And um, it... It's got a lot of bangers. Yeah, it's got Spice Girls. It has Casey and JoJo. Oh, yeah. That's a that's like Radiohead. These are all very um, nice. Backstreet Boys. It's just a good mix. Karma Pol... Uh, Car no, no, sorry. That's, that's Flagpole Sitta. Yeah, that's Radiohead. <laughs> Flagpole Sitta, that song. Um, Janet Jackson. Just It's such a good album. I love it, actually. <laughs> it holds up. Um, it's, I'd, I guess I'd probably pick a song from that album, maybe. Oh my god, his little gray polka dots. <laughs> so cute. Yeah, that's a, that's a hard one. Uh, yeah, he just chat. has this everywhere. Add us what is... All what? over himself. Sorry. Yeah, no, you're good. Uh, interrupting. What is the most 90s song? Add us. Yeah. And I will tell you why. Unless it's... Well, we'll see. <laughs> maybe, maybe you'll be right. Maybe I can be convinced. Okay. Uh, this is from... Speaking of what hop adding us. Uh, Kuno, Kunochi Jenkins uh, says, Hi, I wanted to thank Meg. I just finished listing, uh, I'm just listening to The Stand Uncut and it was Ooh. just an awesome book. Uh, you're yeah. welcome. Yeah. And like, I have listened, read it, listened to it 
almost ten times, I want to say. I don't know it. I know okay. it's Stephen King. Yeah. But I've not, I haven't actually listened to it myself. It's, um, it's f like 45 or 40, I can't remember, 45 plus hours long. Oh, wow. To listen to. It's, it's a big book. Okay. It's huge. <laughs> yeah. Um, and, uh, it's Apocalypse. Oh, okay. Which is my favorite. Listen, I can, I like, an, I like a nice Apocalypse book. Yeah. Now, is it Apocalypse or Post-Apocalypse? It's Apocalypse. They they start from right before. Oh, wow. Okay. And the follow-up, like the, the, or the fallout, right? And how humanity moves on. But anyway, yeah, that's my favorite book of all time. I, I absolutely love it. I was devastated with the recent show oh, that came no. out. It was just like, what is this? This is garbage. <laughs> yeah. Uh, didn't that come out in the 90s? That's there. What... Yes. The oh. original. Uh-huh made for tv series came out in 1994 oh wow okay I was 10 years old and um it's it's great like it's his i think it's the best made for tv uh stephen king adaptation made stephen king is very 90s in my head actually <laughs> yeah yeah uh, yeah, yeah um what is it um what's the what's he's the always one? coming out with new stuff what's the one with sutter kane uh, it's the one about, it's like, it's a book about not Stephen King. Some, it's about a book about, no, sorry, it's a movie based on a book about an author who's, you know, he's writing these like eldritch horrors. Okay. But it like turns out to be true. Have you seen that? No. No. Oh man. Someone let me know. <clears throat> cool. In chat. What the name is. Cause I can't remember at the top of my head. How is our poll doing? It's still on Grunge Rock. Uh, it did fall slightly. Yeah, it did. Uh, so. Really? Grunge? <laughs> I mean, it is very 90s. It is very 90s. But Yeah. All right. Let's see. Oh, wow. We got a lot of ats. And now I got to go back and find uh -oh. where they started. Um. I cannot wait for us to be monetized and oh, yeah. partner with YouTube because that's when you can actually send all the super chats. You can connect it to your Discord yeah. and um, that will make this a whole lot easier. Process, we won't yeah. Be we like, can actually go back and look at yeah, them. Yeah, <laughs> without losing all of our... <laughs> um, losing our spot. Yeah. It's so awkward. Um, let's see. Zach says... <laughs> Favorite weird 90s sodas and does anyone else remember <clears throat> Almond Smash... No, that's made up. Was that just a Northeast thing? I think he's lying. Yeah, that's 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 false. <laughs> I will made say up. Cactus Cooler. Cactus Cooler? That kind of came out. Oh, really? I don't know. Wow. Okay, I was a little baby, so. I think it still exists. I actually don't know if it exists. You guys tell <clears throat> us if it exists. Um, Cactus Cooler was like pineapple. Oh, okay. And citrus, I think. I can't remember, but the can was like designed to look like as an Arizona sunset, you know, like just like there were cactus and um, it was like orange and yellow. Interesting. No, I've never, I've never heard. But of I this. remember that drink from the nineties. I, um, I okay, think that's when it came out. I don't know. It was popular. So this might not actually be nineties. This is one of those things where it's like in my mind, it's all blended right, together. Exactly. Was Sobe from the nineties? Sobe. So it has like a little lizard on it. Oh, yes. That sounds so familiar. Yeah. Yes. Is that 90s? It's ringing a bell. That might be like early 2000s. Though. I, I don't actually yeah. remember. Yeah, I don't remember. Okay. But yeah, what kind of drink was that again? Uh, it was just like a like Snapple-esque. Okay. Juice. Okay. Generic okay. juice. Yeah. Yeah. I don't um, know if that counts. He did say soda, didn't he? Yeah, but it's Zach. It's yeah. fine. He, he's not super chatting us ever, <laughs> so we don't need to... Go, go. Respect the integrity of his question. <laughs> I'm just kidding, Zach. Um, yeah, those are so. So my answer is Sobe. If if that's correct, it if counts. not all, that's all right. <laughs> <laughs> Sobe. Wow. Reminds me of like I don't know, body glove and yeah, that's like weird. Gecko. <clears throat> um, Pez, the polychromatic. 
Saray can complete the 90s ensemble by wearing hammer pants. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh. I remember these. Is that, is that parachute pants? Is that the same thing or is yeah. it different? <sighs> like, it's like really baggy in the butt. Yeah. And then like a tapered leg. Yeah, okay. I remember, and then like there were crazy, like little boys I remember wore crazy 90s patterns. Like the pants would be purple and there'd be like yellow, like zigzags all over it. Uh -huh. And then like speckles, like paint splatter. And it was just like crazy. So, so these 90s yes. red marines. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> I think I understand where they're getting their uh, inspiration yeah, from. Yeah, it was wild. Bring back parachute pants. <laughs> yeah, do it, Saray. Okay, I'll, I'll spearhead this. Yes. All right, uh, here's where I'm at. I'm gonna, I will get a better angle. On, you know, I'll throw it on the Lumix once I'm actually done. But here's where we're at a little, is... sorry. You know, I think we're a little over. So let me see if I can block the light a little bit. Sorry, I know it's not super Yeah, focused. we're really upset with you. Don't worry, I'll throw it on the Lumex soon. Yeah, let me know when. Yeah. Uh, I'm going to finish this other shoulder up and then I'll... Oh my gosh, something happened in our kitchen. <laughs> I don't uh, know. Something's going wrong with the something pesto, it sounds fell. like. Oh yeah, we're having pesto for lunch, guys. Yeah, what do you guys have for lunch? 90s, I would say decidedly not 90s. Uh, pesto is not 90s. No. That's definitely not like a 90s food. Mid-2000s food. He's doing it all wrong. No. Um, well, should we start thinking about meme of the week? We should, memes? actually. Memes? Me, it's memes of the week. And we're gonna, I'm gonna hit memes, There's which is right lot. here. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Speak your fries. Yeah, this came up in chat I saw today. Yeah. <laughs> I think Fugs was teasing about baked fries. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I don't think, I, I don't know what the context of this is. Okay. Clearly it's from Titans. Like, I know, I know the, the, the fries no. thing. No. But it's why does not. Zach look so angry? Okay. <laughs> so we had Brett. Wait, it was you too, right? I can't remember it anymore now. But we were doing dinner and Zach made fries. Oh, yeah. No, I, I know you, the fries. Okay. Well, Zach does not approve of baked fries. Yes. Like, he gets triggered if you talk about <laughs> baking fries in the oven. Yeah. Um, And as a, you know, like... Before I met Zach, my my family, like, comes from a very Midwest-esque <laughs> upbringing where, like, packaged foods and simplicity and, yeah. like, getting dinner done without a lot of mess was the priority. <laughs> yeah. And um, his family is not like that at all. Like, his family is like, nope, food needs to be great and... Uh, there needs to be effort. Mess be damned, <laughs> you know? So he fries the the frozen fries. Yes. And they're so much better. <laughs> yeah, it's so, yeah, they don't taste like cardboard. Yeah. They're quite good. But my question is, why does he look so, like, what's that picture for? Why does oh, he look so angry? I don't know. That picture, that picture's from Titans. Yes. I'm but guessing he's just, like, looking at, like, trying to see something he's at a like, distance. He's going like this. He's making this, like... Like, oh. face, like, like yell face. <laughs> and I don't remember why. So I can't answer that for you. Maybe he'll tell us in chat and we'll read it in yeah. like 30 minutes. Yeah. Once we've forgotten what we're talking about. Um, I like this one because it has all of us in it. Yes. Yeah, sure. Very cute. Um, but yeah, Brett kept harassing us with addle addle questions. And nobody could say addle addle, axolotl. Like, <laughs> he's giving us all these tongue twisters. Yeah. Yeah. No, and that's why he's not invited back. Anymore. No, he won't, he's not he won't be on the show anymore. <laughs> You're never going to see him again. <laughs> I think he's um, actually coming over later today. Yeah. Right? <laughs> Just to be clear. Um, yeah, Bucket. This is our Lord Bucket. It protects the studio for me. The Emperor protects? No. The Bucket. The Bucket protects. <laughs> yeah, um, so this is, this is uh, the... Bucket of challenge butter that is uh, protecting our power surge. So if that fails, uh, the whole stream's going down. Yeah, we just won't see you anymore. Yeah. I bump into something in the studio every day. Every day <laughs> I mess with a camera or a light and like bump it out of place. So you got, always got to check your, check your settings yes. before we stream because I will have messed it up by then. I love this. <laughs> Listen, this is the 80s, I'm pretty sure. So, 
I'm, it, it bled over. <laughs> there's there's some crossover. <laughs> uh, look, if if I had to be compared to any character from a sitcom, Urkel's like pretty good. Urkel's great. He was a great character. Yeah. I loved Family Matters. Good old Urkel. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Sorry, I'm I'm finishing. No, the, you're fine. But this thing this right now, so face is from our our last short. Oh, what? Uh, our last couple of shorts where we talk about mar space marine lore. Oh, yes. Also related to today. Oh, yeah. Where I, I, I torture Meg and make her listen to me prattle on about space marines. <laughs> <laughs> well, I learned a lot. I, I didn't I didn't hate it. Yeah, uh, we, it was fun. <laughs> yeah. Uh, space marines are really weird. And I feel no like kidding. that's something that is kind of lost, you know, nowadays. So I felt like I needed to let Meg know that. Yeah. I'm not into the boring faction. I'm into the the guys who eat ceramic. I'm into the lizard <laughs> suit. Yeah. Um, it was so funny because in the comments you get these like space marine um, fanatics, right? Who are like, well, like you can Asian. you can play Daughters of Cain, yeah, like or Sisters not Daughters of Battle. Like, Sisters of Battle. It's not the same. Right? And I'm just like, all right, separate but equal. You're right. Yeah, you're right. Okay. <laughs> Yeah, there's, so there's the Horace Heresy has 70 books. How many Sisters of Battle books are there? Okay. Yeah. They're not the same. <laughs> it's it's okay, guys. Yeah. We're just goofing yeah. around. Also, like, we're not, this is not a serious little it's channel. Not. Right? We're just messing around. All right. <laughs> uh, <laughs> <laughs> I just love Brett's face. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, I don't know what else there is to say. It's a great use of it. Yeah. Poor Brett. <laughs> yeah. Uh, he. I think he, he's like, oh, I hate this face. And it's like... Well, he was, get used you know, to it. <laughs> I think, you know, he, he played it off like he was joking. Mm -hmm. But deep down, I think there's he a little part of his that he loves, it. he loves it, but maybe it also dies a little every time yeah. he has to see it. <clears throat> uh, yeah, save it. <laughs> yeah, more Brett. Okay, more Brett. this is like the two <laughs> best Brett faces ever. Thank the, you, Bryce, for this meme. <laughs> the switched eyes is amazing. I'll never get tired of it. Anytime you guys want to like up your chances for one of your memes getting showcased just use brett's switched eyes face <laughs> i cannot get over it it's very good it cracks me up to no end i was laughing like making the meme slides <laughs> it's a great uh, there it is again <laughs> <laughs> yes that was me yeah. <laughs> like saray's gonna come in yeah. and think i'm insane no this is perfect <laughs> <laughs> it's so good <laughs> I gotta skip it so I'll be quiet. Uh, look, that's basically how you got. Um, we should have recorded it. Brett was. I know. He couldn't believe how good the fries were. Oh, he wouldn't stop. Yeah. It was so funny. <laughs> <laughs> sorry. Yeah. Uh, sorry. Yeah. I sorry, not sorry. Yeah, sorry, sorry. Um, cats for mod. This is my cat bar talk. Yeah. And uh, we got a behind the scenes pic of him included in the memes so i was like oh my baby we have yeah. to include him today. yeah <laughs> he's so cute and it's a nice play on uh cass's eternal plight yes to become a mod somewhere which she will never reach oh boy you know it's one of those things like we can't ever actually give it to him at this no point. Like, no this that would point, ruin the meme yeah sorry so, cass sorry cass uh uh this is our ultimate crossover it's a hobby collab <laughs> and Titans and Liam. <laughs> yeah, this is a, uh, listen, I, you know, you're going to see later Mario might come up again for some reason. Mm -hmm. Yeah, couldn't but, imagine why. Uh, uh, Super Mario, uh, the original Mario Kart, I'm going to say, not that good. <laughs> no. <laughs> I, I played it a lot. Yeah. But it's not a great game. Was it on Nintendo? So the, first the super, or Super NES? You know, oh, I actually don't know. Because I played the Super NES. Yeah, that's the version I played I as well. I liked that one. But you didn't? Okay, sorry. It, <laughs> what, I, a, listen, what do I know? I played it a lot. I I went back and played it, I don't want to say recently, within the last decade. Yeah. I'm going to say it does not hold up. Okay. It's not. Bad. Well, not with the, like, the GameCube version and... Yeah, the, Whatever else is... I'm like, that's where my knowledge ends, yeah, is GameCube, GameCube. <laughs> which is like 20 years Gaming old. Gaming stopped at the GameCube. Yeah. All this other stuff. Oh my just... gosh. I know. <laughs> okay. <laughs> two really great Bridger faces. If you guys were here last Sunday, we had everybody <laughs> on our stream. It was super fun. So we got a lot of good shots of Bridger. 
because he's see, he's I'm, such a ham. I want to see these switched up where like Bridger's like reaching, you know, putting reaching his uh, hand around for that shoulder. Yeah, around the other Bridger. It's like, is this? Does that become incestuous, or um, just narcissistic? A uh, little A, a little B. Yeah. <laughs> Yay, oh God. here's the way I, <laughs> <laughs> I uh, put on this album before the stream because I was like, I want to know what is being referenced here. Mm -hmm. Good it's music. Nice. It was nice. good music, yeah. actually. It's very soothing. Uh, yeah, this is because I got caught behind the scenes uh, shotgunning whipped cream. Yes. I don't even know what you would call it. Yes. Putting whipped cream in my mouth. Yeah. Straight from the can. Yeah. I want to make sure I get some of the uh, propellant. Mm -hmm. flavor yeah i i tried shotgunning it in zach's mouth the other day <laughs> and i wasn't doing it right and he just kept getting aerosol <laughs> <laughs> yeah uh, did he like get high off of it or? well i didn't do it that much uh, okay. but uh it was funny <laughs> if i mention, never mind <laughs> i'm not gonna say it oh okay <laughs> i was gonna ask if we could get demonetized but i'm just gonna we don't, we're not monetized yet, so, like, why? Like, I guess we can't get demonetized yeah. then. <laughs> we're Good already point. not. They have to review the channel, though. I know. Was They're going to sit and watch all 4,000 yeah. of our hours. Um, okay, this is from Holly. <laughs> <laughs> I <laughs> thought, when I first saw this, I was dying. <laughs> yeah, dying. it's really funny. <laughs> this is Saray's impression of The Hobbit. <laughs> <laughs> I think I did a pretty good job. It fits pretty much perfectly. Yes. So please zoom in when you get a chance yeah. and take a look at Sir Tiny Sir <laughs> as Bilbo. Little Bilbo. Uh, Holly's first meme. She wanted. She was Aww. very proud of it. Yeah, it's cute. I remember my first meme. I was very proud of myself too. I think she set a bar that's very high now, though. Yeah. So, you know. Well, that's all our memes for today. Yep, that's all of them, and uh, yeah. That was fun. That was good. <laughs> I'm like, I was there. Where were you when this meme was Where born? Where were you when the memes were born? I'm working on my second level of spots. So they're lightening up a little bit. All right. Once I get through um, this level, I think I will put it on the glam cam. Because yeah. you, you might actually be able to see something. So I'm actually going to throw mine on the glam yeah. cam now. Because I'm not actually sure. Thank you for the hearts. <gasps> oh, Saray. I'm not sure if it's actually, uh, I don't know if his helmet, you know, I've, pa I've painted literally an army of these and I can't remember if they have stripes on their helmet. <laughs> Just I do it. Yeah. So I think I probably, I know they have a red stripe down the helmet. Um, and I know the backpack is supposed to be black. So, uh, oh, yeah. I'm going to, I don't know if my phone's in here. Can you bring up that picture? Oh, wait. On my phone? Yeah, actually, I'll go. Oh, okay. Yeah. Well, it looks super cool, man. I love it. Ugh, I was like a little nervous to do something that intricate. It's not super but difficult. But it actually. looks like, I'm like, oh, that looks doable. But oh, yeah. very cool. <laughs> Ugh. But to have salamanders. Yeah. Uh, looks like they have a little bit, so I, I'm not finished yet, people. Roughhouse says, okay, so we're getting into some folks uh, sharing what chapter mm -hmm. they're doing. Oh, sweet. So, Roughhouse is doing it. Awesome. Yeah, Roughhouse. I'm actually doing Darren Latham's okay. custom chapter, the Necropolis Hawks. Ooh, yeah. They're usually only Primaris, so it's going to be fun to do them in a 90s style. What does that mean, they're usually only Primaris? So, as you'll recall, when we had our, uh, our when I when I lore uh, shotgun you in the face, uh, mm -hmm. There is two. There are two type of types of marines. Yeah. There's firstborn, which is the, the old marines, and then there's born. Yeah, firstborn. And then so these are like the daddies <clears throat> of all like the new space. Marines. Yeah. Or yes. Okay. <laughs> um, there's the firstborn and this primary. So the primaris are like the new one. If you were to go, you know, look at a modern space marine, you'd probably see the primaris. Mm -hmm. So. Technically, they're not the same thing. Okay. So he's doing this marine, which is a first one marine, in a scheme that is only associated with the, Got it. the, okay. the new marines. Oh, so you get to interpret for yourself. Yeah. That's fun. This blizzard suit, like I was looking at a newer version of it, and it looked like there were not spots everywhere. Uh, 
You know, we're gonna we're gonna stick with the source material. And I was just oh, like, that's oh. so sad. Yeah, what happened to the spots? I like the spots. They need to bring. Yeah, I I I think space. I think forty k in general is best when it's kind of wacky and stupid. Yeah, I agree. Yeah, <laughs> I like wacky and stupid. Yeah. All right, so I'm just doing this little hat here. He's got a little hat. <laughs> Little space marine hat. Okay, I really like that. Um, yeah, I actually painting space marines is not bad. No, they're like, quite yeah forgiving. Yeah, um, which I wasn't expecting. I don't know why. I just was like, um, like yeah. you know, like armor. It's yeah. gonna be hard. I don't, I don't know what to do. But um, after I gassed us, I was like, oh, these are nice. Actually, there's a lot of yeah. like flat surfaces and well to me what the nicest thing is or one of the nice things about them is that they're mostly one material yeah like there's not a lot there's not skin there's not hair there's not that's true you know two different kinds of you know animal hide and then fur it's it's just mm -hmm. generally one thing yeah which makes it quick and pretty painless now obviously it's one of those things where you can put a thousand hours into it yeah if you want to but just to get something that looks nice is really not too much work, comparatively. Yeah. I'm liking it. All right. Let's see. Where are we at? Battle Line Minis. Hi. Oh, hey. <clears throat> You're here. Yeah, cool. It's Howling Griffins for me. I wanted something iconic 90s Marine and a fun challenge. Uh, yeah, Howling Griffins are super cool. And Laura, I'm doing the thing, but still trying to decide on a chapter. Yeah. I, maybe our chart will help you. I don't know. I'm sh I mean, not our chart. The chart we shared. I say you do Rogue Trader Minotaurs. They're kind of like this, but they're like, <laughs> like a, bunch okay. of, a bunch of red. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Um, yeah, there were some in there with quite a few zigzaggy things. Yeah. They went a little crazy with them. Mm -hmm. Yep. All right. Barry. Nope. Captain Mannerings. <laughs> Fugs. Time to rock frosted tips in a fanny pack with a snap bracelet. Uh, Captain Mannerings. I need to find an arm for a sergeant model. Laura has our complete marine. Oh, nice. So <laughs> you're almost there. You can almost do the challenge. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, but if you don't get that arm, Darren Latham will come find you. So, mm -hmm. like, make yeah. sure you find it. Yeah. Um, Brett was nice enough to donate a couple of his older Marines because I don't have yeah, I didn't any have of this stuff. Um, so that was nice of him. Otherwise, I would not have been able to do it. No, me neither. Because I was not going to go searching. <laughs> but yeah. Thank goodness for Brett. It's a shame he's never going to be on the show. I yet. know. Too bad. We'll miss you, Brett. Yeah. Barry, not painting, but I found my OG Space Hulk box with oh, wow. 80s Terminators. That's even Clip cooler. on weapons and massive whip antenna. Oh my gosh, do an 80s scheme. <laughs> Why not? Just keep riffing. Yeah. I love it. Um, oh, Soup says the most 90s song, Smash Mouth All-Star. That's 90s? See, that's one that's like right on the line. I don't to know. Me. Are you, is that like 99? Oh. Or is he screwing Yeah, when that? did Shrek come out? <laughs> Like, when I think of that song, I think Shrek. Yeah, I think that's, like, I don't know. that's normal. Yeah. Let's see. All-Star. Smash Mouth. Came out in... Yes, it was 1999! Okay, it counts. Call. It's yeah. right on the line. All right, we'll give it to you. But yeah, you're right. That's, like, classic. Oh, my gosh. Zach says, smells like teen spirit. That is extremely 90s, mm -hmm. yeah. Oh, Pezler says, you can't touch this. That's... Uh, MC that, Hammer, yeah. Is that like... Is it 80s? Is that... I feel like that's also kind of borderline. I remember singing it as a kid, like, with uh, my girlfriends, <laughs> like that, and, like, Big Butts. Um, big, big thing I in like the 90s. I like Big Butts, and I cannot lie. <laughs> yeah, uh, let's see. I need to look it up now. Um, I feel like that's, like... That's gotta be early. Mbop. Yeah, Mbop is on the Now album. Yeah. And I was, like, singing along to it today. I was like, I hated this when it came out. Yeah. But now I'm like, it's fun. <laughs> um, you can't touch this. 
song <laughs> came <laughs> out. 1990. Yeah, okay, it's right. So it's we've right got right those are our bookends. Those are yeah. our bookends. We've got you <laughs> can't touch this. Touch this to smash <laughs> mouth. Now, oh, yeah, that's start. quite yeah. a range. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks guys for bookending yeah. the 90s for Thank us. You. That's great. Um Barry also says sadly the 90s song is Celine Dion from Titanic. Um Yeah. It's a good like it's it stands out, but I wouldn't use it to define the Define decade. yeah, define yeah. the 90s now. Yeah. Oh my gosh. So many good call outs here. I'm going to keep working on spots. Yeah. I'll let you uh, take yeah, it. Yeah, I'll take over. Uh, <laughs> let me just finish this little. Because uh, I got yeah, We need to pain. ignore chat for a second and work on our well, 90s work. Marines. Jeez, chat. <laughs> We're halfway through and I'm still on spots. Yeah. That's all right, though. All right. I'll do a quick one while uh, I'm. Uh, I was just talking about the first. Uh... Kurt the Viking says, probably smells like Teen Spirit, but going to throw uh, throw a Don't Speak by No Doubt. In oh, there. yeah. That's another good one. Yeah, I feel like I think you point, you make a good point. Like, it probably is Smells Like Teen Spirit. Mm-hmm. Probably. It probably is. Uh, uh, I don't know. I'm, I'm just going to throw some out there, though. Like, Poison, Belle Biv DeVoe. That's like... Nineteen ninety. Uh, uh, I mean, hold on. <laughs> what? Because we're totally um leaving out the Spice Girls, and I think Wannabe deserves to be on this Ooh, list. That is, that yeah. Is quite... All of all of the boy bands too, mm -hmm. like I know. Oh my gosh, and I I didn't like this stuff. Like I I liked. I was a daddy's girl. Like I, I liked all the stuff my dad was into. I like Queen. I like, and I still do. Def Leppard, Ozzy Osbourne. Yeah. Queens Reich, that the, Cheap yeah. Trick, all that stuff. And then there'd be all this '90s like pop that was super popular, and I was like, "This is dumb. This is bad." My dad also thinks this is dumb. <laughs> <laughs> but as I got older, I was like, "Oh yeah, oh, yeah. this is my childhood." Yeah. You can, you learn to appreciate. Mm -hmm. All right, let's look at some polka dots real quick. Yeah. It's funny. Little mix. We'll, we'll poke it off. Oh, wow. That's awesome. Oh, good. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> it's getting there. So that's like two layers up. I'm, I'm skipping the layer. The layers are not as transitional. Right. Um, but that's all right. No, that's I'll great. I'll go up another level and then maybe move on to the beak. beak. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, I was just Captain Mannerings. I was discovering metal and fear factory demanufacture defined the late 90s for me. Yeah. yeah, so this is something I was thinking of, thinking of on the way down. It's like, well, also there was like... Okay, I'm going to be fully transparent. I don't really know my metal. That's all right. My metal music. But I feel like 90s metal was its own... Thing. Was it like coming into its own thing? Like, is that like, like Metallica? Metallica? I guess Metallica is a little bit later, but... Yeah, and Korn. And you mean all that stuff? Like yeah. Korn and um, Limp Bizkit and... Or is that more 2000s? I'm I think that's more 2000s. Yeah. Let us know. This, um, is, this is a blind spot for yeah, me. Yeah, because I'm... I liked, I didn't get into more like goth or metal music till late 90s. Yeah. That was when Bride of Chucky came out. <laughs> and that was my awakening. <laughs> yeah. Um, Please enlighten Pantera, me. Pantera, all that. Yeah. You know. I mean, it's like I know of these. Yeah. But like, I don't know. Slayer. I don't, like in my mind, it's kind of a, I don't know yeah. when, when that was and like what defines that. Yeah. I was very into <clears throat> Rob Zombie. Yeah. That was that was probably like the best concert I went to. Oh wow. As I've... as a young person. <laughs> it was fun because he was he's very into Alice Cooper mm -hmm. and like his sets, his his stages would have like monsters and like cool backdrops and a lot of props and it was mm -hmm. just very cool looking. Like, yeah. Like, scary and spooky. Yeah, I love that guy. Um, but yeah, I, I'm trying to think. Metal. Yeah, I mean, that's some, feel free to let us know. I think I listen, I actually didn't listen to a lot of metal. Yeah, like, I, I, it's, like I said, it's a blind spot for me. a little bit, yeah. Also, what is Daft Punk? We, we, you said it was electronic, but we were like, is this before yeah. EDM? Is it house? It's not techno, or is it? I, I don't know. Yeah. I yeah. Feel, is it its own thing? I'm like, it's Daft Punk. Yeah, exactly. Daft yeah. Punk's Daft Punk. 
But that's like, in my head, that's like, oh, that's super 90s. Yeah, you're right. Let's see. Sorry, I'm trying to look up to where we left off because it did skip ahead again. Oh, yeah. In chat. It's broken. It's so broken. Oh my gosh, so many good call outs here. It's like, I want to make a playlist. We should, actually. From the songs called out in <laughs> chat. We can call it... What? Nin the chat tells us, chat plays the 90s. Chat plays the 90s. Okay, yeah, let's do that. Let's make a, after this stream, we'll go back in the live chat and we'll make a little Spotify playlist Yeah. of all the songs you guys recommend because there's so many good ones. Alanis Morissette, Ironic. Oh my gosh. Yes. Oh no. Wiped a little bit of paint off. Oh yeah. Peach tea Snapple. Oh man. Uh, That's a drink, oh. right? That's not not a song. <laughs> Pezzler, the polychromatic. We can't forget Fido Dido from Seven Up, and also Kevin from Rainbow Rainbow Chips Ahoy. What? What is this? What is <laughs> happening? Fido Dido is that the name? That's a cool spot. It's like a right. What's Fido Dido? No, yeah, Seven Up had the spot. Yeah, cool spot. Yeah. Okay. Uh, do you know what he's talking about? No. Okay, good. It's not just me. <laughs> Explain yourself. Yeah. You're confusing us. Which isn't difficult. <laughs> yeah, it's not difficult. Um, another reminder to like and subscribe to the stream. Yes. Minnie Mare says, My 90s were dominated by the Levelers, Panda Pops, and Bass Shandy, none of which will make sense to any Americans. You know what? I was thinking about that. Yeah. Our 90s may be very different yeah. from like a, a non-U.S. Yeah. person's 90s. Um, I, and that that's a good point. Like, I'm very curious to see, like, folks from other countries. Like, what was your 90s experience like? Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Also, yeah. Let us know, because, like, I feel like we have a pretty... You know, that was not pre-internet, but, like... Right. Internet wasn't, like, as widespread as it was. So, right. like, we were much more sectioned off. Yeah. So, yeah. I mean, the most British thing I ever seen was Spice Girls. So, right. Which is very British, to be right. fair. But you Well, know. you got you got all the good hair metal bands out of Yeah, that's also true. Out of Britain too. True. Good old Def Leppard. All right. <clears throat> um, let's see. <laughs> Keep going. Slowly, slowly. <laughs> all right. Yeah, Family Matters counts. Thank you, Soups. Rudy, as someone born in the late 1900s, <laughs> <laughs> GoldenEye video game, Blockbuster yeah. video on Tuesdays, yes. Oh my gosh, how did we forget these? I know, Blockbuster. I just went to the last Blockbuster, it was crazy. Um, the Rise of Image Comics, End of the Road by Boys to Men, yeah. yes. And Push Pops Nerds. Oh yeah, I remember Push Pops. Yeah. Those are all great. I, those are much better than what we're gonna, than the stuff I said. Speaking of which, we're, we're about getting to start, there. Yeah, we're gonna start that segment yeah. momentarily. We want to reflect back on what the '90s was to us. Yes. Yeah. Because uh, we were both different points in our life. Like, uh, I think we're a decade apart, right? Not quite, but okay. close. Okay. Yeah. We're very close. Yeah. So this will be kind of fun. Yeah. We're going to have very di different interpretations. Of the 90s, yeah. All right. Uh, I'm going to finish this up, and then we'll go to it. Let's do it. Actually, maybe I'll throw this on the glam, glam cam, and then we'll start this up. Yeah. Because it's going to let it dry. You guys are in for a treat. Yeah. Uh, in the meantime, yeah. let's see. Do one more question, maybe. Yeah. And then all of a sudden, this is when it stops. Yeah. <laughs> Rudy Picardo, more 90s getting music CDs, but only liking two thirds of the songs. Yes. <laughs> yes, because you had to buy the CD. Yeah, that's right. Until Napster came out and saved us all, freed us all from the tyranny of crappy yeah. albums. Uh, movies, Ghost. Ghost is on my top five list. Oh, is it? It is. Wayne's World. Wayne's World. Yeah, I was just thinking that when yes. you mentioned uh, Alice Cooper. Yeah. Jurassic mm -hmm. Park. The know, Fifth like, Element. Oh, these are all so, so good. good. So Classic, very 90s. Yeah. Um, is Rush Hour 90s? That doesn't... Rush Hour? That might be like 2000. I think that's 2000s. 
But it's good too. Yeah. Saving Private Ryan, The Matrix. Yeah. Matrix was brought up. I didn't. I didn't put it on my list, but. Yeah, Starship Troopers. Yeah. Oh my gosh. Well, I actually watched that recently. Did you? Pretty good. Hold up. Does it hold up? Yeah, I mean, as long as you, yes. I don't want to get too much into it. As long as you realize that you're not supposed to be rooting for these people, much like uh, 40k. You know? Oh great. Yeah. So I can root for the bugs. Yeah. That's what I want to do anyway. Yeah. Okay, um, I'm going to throw this up. Yeah, let's do it. Our little guy's coming together. Oh, it looks beautiful. Be careful in the backpack. Okay, it's wet. Yeah. This is where we are with our badab salamander. Yeah, good. Yeah. Okay. Look at that. Ooh, I around. love the orange low light. Yeah. It's nice. Actually, pink. Uh, this is where okay. they start, and then you put the pink and then the yellow filter mm -hmm. over it turns it orange. There he is. All right, let's uh, let's start this segment. Yeah, let's do it. We go to the nineties. Okay, <laughs> I didn't know we were starting with this one. This is what uh, the nineties <laughs> is to us. Yes, so that's me. Baby, uh, so look, don't mess with me. So cute. Uh, I loved. Like, I wasn't allowed to play Mortal Kombat, but I would see it, and I loved Sub-Zero. Yeah. Um, to me, that's very 90s. Yeah. Um, I don't think... Mortal I don't Kombat. Think, now that I'm thinking about, did Sub-Zero even have size? That's like more of a Ninja Turtles thing. I think I'm mixing up my... Maybe you did. I don't remember, though. little kid I was. Oh my god, yeah. Like most <laughs> little kids. Um, I mean, they can't help it, right? What a... Yeah. But, uh... I don't remember. I was not... I liked Mortal Kombat, but I didn't have, like, the characters memorized or anything. <clears throat> I didn't play it that much. You didn't have the song memorized from the movie? No. Oh, okay. I had Mortal Kombat. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's... That's actually... That's the number one song in the 90s, people. There you go. <laughs> the Techno Syndrome, uh, the Mortal the, Kombat song. Solved the mystery. Yeah. Uh, so, yeah, this is where I was in the 90s at some point. Super uh, wearing ninja suits. Yeah. Uh, in, set, in front of some what looks like very messed up drapes. <laughs> What's going on with that? Uh, where's the hit next? Book? Oh, hit uh, 90s? Oh, there you yeah, go. Yeah, there you go. All right. So this is my list. Right, okay. I know I just talked about uh, Mortal Kombat for a couple minutes, but uh, I also think of Killer Instinct because this game, like, scared me oh. as a child. There is a... Um, there's a character in here who's a skeleton. Um, yes, a skeleton with a sword. And uh, that game gave me nightmares. Oh, no. I, 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 I would play it, but, like, I would not allow anyone to choose the skeleton. <laughs> like, oh, that's so I cute. I would storm <laughs> off if anyone chose the skeleton. <laughs> a little, <laughs> a little angry Yeah, Yeah, you, no, you can't choose him. Um, I love that. Yes. Uh, all right, here, here's a question for chat. Um... Favorite Mortal Kombat character, hmm. but only from the 90s one. So that's Mortal Kombat 1, 2, and maybe 3? I don't think 3. I think 3 came in 2000. Okay. Yeah. Uh, yes. Of course. M yes. We, Classic. We, my, uh, my childhood was full of game video games, I'm realizing now, because this was all the stuff that came to me first. Uh, look, it's Mario. Yeah. It's super 90s. It doesn't really get any more 90s than that. Yeah. Yeah. It's great. I love this game too. Yeah. It's still and Duck holds Hunt. It. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> it came, Duck it Hunt. Came with Duck Hunt. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, it's Thompson Goombas. <laughs> yes. Uh, yeah. Sexy Jeff. <laughs> yes. Jeff Goldblum. Sexy Jeff Goldblum. That's what I think of when I think mm -hmm. of the nineties. Uh, Jurassic oh, Park. Are. Someone already said it. Uh, this is one of my favorite movies, and I think it still holds oh, up. Oh yeah. Nothing beats the original. No. No way. I'm going to be like one of those old people and be like, back in my day, Jurassic Park was good. Yes. Well, this is pretty much the only yeah. good one. Uh, yeah. I, I agree. Chris Pratt, come on now. I mean, it doesn't make any sense. No, but it doesn't. We, we won't. This is the only good one. Mm -hmm. This is the only one we should remember. Mm -hmm. And this thing. <laughs> yeah. Matches this, your headband. This is the maybe most 90s thing ever. Yeah. What even is this? What's was, the design? I Yeah. I don't know. Why? But it it's it's so iconic. You were so good to call it out. Yeah. 90s cup. 
And it's not, <laughs> but here's the thing, it wasn't just a cup. I would see this painted on walls in the mall. Yes! It's yeah. like a design aesthetic. Yeah. It, it just scribbles and this color, this teal yeah, color. Teal. Zach came in here and said that we had a blue, we have blue and green set up. He said that those are not 90s colors. I, I listen. Oh my God. Teal might be the most 90s color teal, that has ever sure. existed. Yeah, and blue and green make teal. Yeah. So everyone knows what are you talking? And purple, like, like we don't have purple. Come but on, Zach. What is Zach talking about? He doesn't know. He doesn't know his colors. Right, I think that's the last one for me, right? No. Oh no, Michael more. Jordan. Most important one. Yes. Look. Uh, I, I had a different picture of me up front that wasn't me in a, a sweet ninja suit. It was me wearing a bulls hat, <laughs> even though I knew nothing about basketball. But like everyone else around me, liked Michael Jordan. So okay, so you weren't <laughs> actually a basketball person. No, I was. Uh, I was more into like Thomas the Tank Engine. Oh, <laughs> yeah. Uh, but yeah, you were still little. I knew who he was, right? And that's like yeah, for me right. to know who he was as a young. We lad. all did. Yeah. I wasn't a basketball person either, but everybody knew Michael Jordan. I mean, Space Jam, hello. Yeah. All right. All right, next is me. Yes. Here you go, There's guys. There's Meg. <laughs> <laughs> this is me. In uh, 1997, I want to say, I was in seventh grade when I took this picture. Boy, I uh, I think I was like your definition dork. <laughs> and this picture, when it when it was, when we got it, I was like, oh, oh, I'm a dork. Oh. That's uh -oh. that's why nobody <laughs> has a crush on me. <laughs> so that's me. That's what I was doing in the 90s. <laughs> um, Nickelodeon, I watched way longer oh, than yeah. I probably should have. And specifically Ren and Stimpy, as I've brought up many times on, on stream, <laughs> really spoke to me. <laughs> yes. Um... That show was a show for weirdos. Nickelodeon had a lot of shows for, for weird, weirdos. Yeah, weirdo. Yeah. Weirdo and I considered myself a weird kid. Like, I liked <laughs> things that my girlfriends didn't like. Uh -huh. I was taller. I ate more. Um, Watch Ren and Stimpy. I watched boy car Like, these were, like, boy cartoons. Yeah. They were gross and weird. And <laughs> I, I will defend <laughs> that these cartoons, all of them, including Ren and Stimpy, great for kids. <laughs> let's kids yes. be weird and being weird is okay i will say the creator of ren and stimpy uh -huh. after it went off the air came back and did um re revamped it like uh -huh. did a new season for what was that it was like a channel for like men i don't remember oh, it was like a very like spike tv spike tv yes yeah and he had those two like having sex with each other <laughs> and like looking at naked women. And I was like, this is for adults. Yeah. Original Ren and Stimpy is just weird and that's yeah. fine. So I will take that to my grave. I love Ren and Stimpy. Original All right. Ren and Stimpy. Moving on. Nickelodeon. 90s interior decor. Yes. <laughs> and this is the house from The Sopranos. I think The Sopranos show summed it up perfectly. <laughs> like... They get it. It's just 90s. There's like, everything is beige or like, <laughs> like pale, look the pale wood on the cabinets. Everything is kind of like in the same value. <laughs> Everything's washed out. House. And yes. It's like, uh... Washed out. And then there's like these Italian, 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 Italian. Italian like looking decor, like very, um, not frilly, but like <laughs> F. <laughs> Flourishy. Yeah. It's got a lot of flourishes. Yeah. Those puffy curtains. Yeah. Super 90s. I, I just remember this being like everybody's house. <laughs> Fashion. <laughs> <laughs> so again, like I didn't dress like this. <clears throat> I did not care about boys yet. Like not, not in that way. I was, I had crushes on boys like all the time. Mm -hmm. My my list would update every day, <clears throat> but I kind of like missed this, these trends, a lot of these trends. Oh, look, there's Princess Di. Yeah. Um, but yeah, Clueless, like this cute like schoolgirl <laughs> look, um, Gwen Stefani in the hair. Uh, look at the parachute pants yep, there that they TLC are. has. <laughs> Classic. Yeah. And then one thing I noticed when I was going back and because I was like doing my makeup for today and I was uh. like, how can I do 90s makeup? So everyone had 
or like what was really popular and trendy was like this blue eyeshadow, uh -huh. like frosty blue eyeshadow. And their faces were so washed out. Like, look at Reese, look at Courtney, look at Drew. Uh -huh. Like, the, they're, it's just, like, white. It's <laughs> starting from the middle. Yeah. And today, like, makeup is very contoured. Yeah. And to a different fault. But um, I was just like, ugh, this is garish. <laughs> like, that flash photography is not, not helping. It doesn't help, yeah. Yeah, it brings out how terrible everyone kind of looks in this makeup. But it's fun. It's kind of yeah. goofy. Yeah. Good stuff. And last one, I had a Sega Genesis. I, I liked video games a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> um, but I had Sega in my room, and I would, I played a lot of Lion King and Ren and Stimpy. Oh, good. And Did you play Sonic? Sonic, of course. Yeah, yeah I loved Sonic. Um, Echo the Dolphin, I tried. Echo the Dolphin's it's good. impossible. Yeah. Yeah. So, I also had some... If you played um, Mortal Kombat, you would have got the blood version. <laughs> yeah, maybe. Yeah, they, they didn't have that on the Nintendo. No. Yeah. You brought up Nickelodeon. Yes. Um, so, okay, this is going to see... No one's going to know this. Okay. They used Those, like, mid-roll, like, self-promotion. You know, they would have, like, Nick, 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 mm -hmm. Nick, Nick, Nick. Yeah. Um, there was one that, like, disturbed me. Okay. And it was... There's a guy, and he comes up, and he's, like, a puppet. Right? And he has, like, a talking mouth. Like, mm -hmm. yeah, 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 yeah. And it was one of those mid-roll ads. Yeah. Um, and, like, I remember as a child, like, freaking me out because, like, this is, like, this is not okay. <laughs> Poor Saray. When I went to college. Oh, no. I went to school for animation. It turns out that guy with the puppet face was one of my teachers. <gasps> that so, is so cool. Yeah. So I'll see if I can. I'll post in the Discord if I can find it. Did you tell him how he freaked you yeah, out Yeah, I was like, what, he showed him. I was like, I was like, oh, my God. You know, in the middle of class. Was, you're just like, all these that was you? flashbacks? Yeah. <laughs> where's that meme where it's like your face yeah, and just like, like oh. a puppet? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Uh, yeah. It, uh, it's okay. terrifying, but very funny. Uh, you know, seeing it much later, it's like, That's oh my so God. That's so cool. You used to scare me as a child. <laughs> but uh, if anyone knows what I'm talking about, you know, you can post it. But I, I, I feel like it's such a niche weird thing that's sure. probably not gonna be found yeah um i really like this is before your time but um i really liked you can't do that on television uh-huh did you ever watch that did you randomly so that that was that was like a skit show on yeah it. yeah a sketch comedy for yeah. kids alanis morissette was on that show actually oh really yeah <laughs> as a child actress it's pretty so neat. crazy i know that was a weird show. That was a very weird show. <laughs> um, Roundhouse was another one. Another sketch comedy. So I didn't watch those. I did watch the... Um... Those were for like big kids. Yeah. Yeah. That was like that was like the, the, the target audience was like, we're teenagers kind of. Yeah. We're like young teenagers. We're making funny off-color jokes. <laughs> kind of. Kind of. But like still pretty safe. Yeah. Silly. Yeah. So silly. What, um, uh, Gak. Ugh, I was gonna say, yeah. They, I used to watch the shows that were the ga kids game yes. shows. Yes, I desperately wanted to be on Double Dare. Double Dare, that's what it's called. Yeah, Mark Summers was the man. <laughs> All right, um, we're probably super behind, so probably. If you have any questions, you can add the Hobby Collab. I'm sure we, we're really behind, but that's okay. Okay. Today's today's a big party. Big 90s celebration. Oh, God. <laughs> Did We're we lose very, it again? very, <laughs> very far. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> uh, wait, wait, wait. No, that sounds right. Yeah, Celine Dion. Okay, there we go. Metal and Fear Factor. Do oh, yeah, we here. did all this. Alanis Morissette <laughs> is mm -hmm. iconic. Yeah. What, what is someone saying I should do? Uh, <laughs> just pesto, yeah. Yeah, not only fries. pesto. That's not even pasta. I said this just earlier. Pesto. pesto is decidedly not nineties food. It's not. No. No. You know what it is? French fries. Mm hmm Uh okay, let's see. Pesler, the polychromatic says, we can't okay, we already read that. For Fido died for seven up, yes. <laughs> uh nine yeah, is pop. That one. Okay, maybe we were we were in the right place. Boy, oh boy. Yeah, we did this. Yep. <laughs> Great. 
Okay, cool. We were we were in the right place. <laughs> okay, great. All right. I think that's as high as I'm going to bring up these spots. Uh, Rudy Picardo says, uh, more 90s getting music CDs, but only, oh yeah, only liking two thirds of the songs. Yeah. Okay, Zach says, best oh, yeah. 90s historical drama, Titanic, Dances with Wolves, Last of the Mohicans, Braveheart, Legends of the Fall. Just kidding about Legends of the Fall. <laughs> when was, what's the movie that's about the Civil War? And it has Denzel Washington and, oh my gosh, it's like Courage or something like that. I don't know. I haven't no. seen it. But that, that also can still be your choice. It might be 2000s though, so I need some. I need to let someone to let me know. I know. know. Um, honestly, I, <laughs> as like cringy as it is, like it might be Braveheart. Yeah. Like yeah, Braveheart it's... is like not historically accurate no. at all. Not like, historically accurate. But I enjoy the movie. Like, yeah. yeah. As long as you. I enjoy watching it. I think it. it's important to, you know, say, like, I know this isn't true. Yeah. But, um, uh, but I mean, at the time, Mel Gibson was all right. Like, everyone yeah. loved him, so yeah. it was okay he to, like, be into Braveheart. Then. Yeah. <laughs> um, but the other one I really, really liked was Dances with Wolves. I did, I think Dances with Wolves might actually be, be my number one. Yeah. Yeah. I remember when it came out, um, I was like, it was 92, so I would have been in second grade, but I loved it. Uh -huh. I loved these long, boring movies, <laughs> even as a kid, um, and just like crying when the horse gets it. Yeah. Uh, yeah. It's and the wolf, the coyote or wolf or whatever it is. Oh my gosh. Spoilers I was just like, I hate for this movie. white men. <laughs> <laughs> Why do they do this? Uh, that's, let's yeah. see. Yeah, if someone can let me know what movie I'm thinking of. <laughs> yeah. It also has the guy, what's the actor from Ferris Bueller? What's his name? Matthew Broderick? I think it's him. Matthew Broderick, Dance okay. Washington. Again, this might be a 2000s movie. Uh, please let us know. Yeah. Okay. Good question, yeah. Zach. <laughs> it's not Titanic, Calling though, I'll tell you that. Out. Oh, yeah, Titanic. Oh, my gosh. I totally forgot. <laughs> Castellan, remember these words. I was, was there, there the day Cass was, was made a mod. mod. Well, we'll see. We'll see. We'll see. It, see, okay. It so, is up to the other mods. So you it's not up to me. You haven't read the Horace Heresy, have you? So this is a line. No, this is one I of the opening not. lines from that book. Cass, uh, very you know interesting line to use considering um, that whole the whole point of that line is that it's a bait and switch and that. That basically you're saying you will act, never actually become yeah. a mod, but someone else named Kaz might be. Oh, so, yeah. can't, or maybe cats. Can't argue with that. Bartok from cats. Mod. Bartok. How sad would that be if Bartok becomes a mod before <laughs> Kaz? I should make a little account for him. You should. So he can get all of his business things done on yeah, YouTube. Was, yeah, it's research. Of, he has a lot of work. <laughs> Ugh. Skipped. Skipped. Movie uh, is glory. Glory. But 1989, 1989, you can't have it. <laughs> I guess I have to do Dances with Wolves. You don't then. have to. Glory really came out in 1989? That's wow. surprising. Let's see. I'm scrolling. I'm scrolling. Oh, man. I got a whoa from Patsy. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry. No, Braveheart was fine at the time. <laughs> at the time. I'm assuming that's what it's in reverence to. <laughs> I don't know. Maybe not. We're so behind. Like the, I love how the uh, um, comments get so yeah. ahead of us. I'm like, I'm just guessing. No one said their favorite Mortal Kombat character, which is a very I, disappointing. I think it's coming up. I'm. It's just that I've gone back. Okay. Also, you can't choose Scorpion. Okay. What about that, Chun Li? Is Chun Li? That's a, a different game. But okay, oh, favorite Street Fighter. There we okay. go, Street Fighter. Yeah, I don't even know. Okay, thanks. Actually, you know what? Forget that. What is the best fighting game of the 90s? You've got Street Fighter 1 and 2, I believe. Okay. Mortal Kombat. Uh, I think Tekken even came out. In oh, yeah, 90s. Tekken. Tekken. Oh, man. Uh, Boris says, Champagne Supernova by Oasis, I think, is mine. Oh, that's his definition of the 90s. Okay, we're going to have to add that to the list because I yeah. don't know what that is. Really? No, I don't. I, don't. I think Oasis is also a big, like... I don't. Okay. I was much more of the hip hop and R and B going. Yeah, on. yeah. Um, 
Well, they're jerks, so it's okay. <laughs> Just the lead singer, I think, but. Okay. Um, yeah, that, I, I did, I liked uh, their little radio hits. Okay. Um, all right, I'm trying to do oh. this beak. And they have. We'll see how it goes. I got a little overzealous here. Mm. They may have gotten a little... So I'm, I'm, the picture I'm looking at does not have this little skull on the helmet. Uh-huh, yeah. So, so I guess I can just paint it whatever color I want, right? Yeah. Okay, great. Like, are there rules around this? Oh, there's rules, and they're going to come after us. Oh, no. Um, let's see. Where are we at? Look at all these songs. Everlong by Foo Fighters. Is that actually the 90s? I'm like, that just came out yesterday. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Start to wither in real time. Captain Mannering's White Zombie and Rom Zombie is still something I listen to. Yeah, same here, man. Mm -hmm. They're it's great. I Good love shop. I love the zombies. Um, Pez Fido Dido is a cartoon mascot for Seven Up. Okay, starting in the late '80s and early '90s, Kevin was the annoying mascot for Chips Ahoy in the '90s. Fun fact: MC Hammer had his own cartoon. <laughs> I did not know this. I did not know that. <laughs> that sounds amazing. We should look it up after the stream. I know that Shaq had a superhero movie. I'm pretty sure that was in the 90s. I think it was called Steel. Oh, okay. I was yeah. thinking Shazam. No, that's... That, that's oh. Sinbad, right? No. Yeah, this is where we're having this this Bernstein bear, Bernstein yeah. bears things like... Which is it? Yeah. Yeah. I'm trying to remember... Um, let's see. Movies really have declined post 2000s. Barry, bite your tongue. <laughs> we have so many good movies. Post 2000s. Listen, there was a, a lot of That's... bad movies in the 90s yes. too, though. <laughs> I, we have we have the the filter of time. There's a lot of bad 90s yeah, movies. Yeah, there's always bad movies. Yeah. Um. Oh my gosh, I'm just enjoying chat having this like. <laughs> Like walk down memory lane <clears throat> yeah. through the nineties, yeah. Reptile. Let's see, scorpion, reptile, Kano, Kano, Goro. Goro's good. Okay, I'm like I don't know these people, so I'm hoping <laughs> they're not just making stuff up. Um, anger on Leghorn. Back in my day, Jurassic Park was futuristic. <laughs> <laughs> it's very true. Yeah. Back in my day. <clears throat> Post-90s picks in Discord. Okay, Rudy. 90s video games. Yes, Resident Evil. I love yeah. watching my boyfriend play this. Uh, Half-Life, Gran Turismo, Tomb Raider, Mario Kart 64, Sonic the Hedgehog, Pokemon Red, Blue, Yellow. Oh my god, how did we forget Pokemon? Yeah. Oh my gosh. I, I wasn't... I was too old for Pokemon. Uh, okay. My little sister, she's 10 years younger than me. Uh -huh. and she was all about Pokemon. Yeah. She's obsessed, yeah. I was on that Poke life. Yeah. All right, everyone who yeah, played thanks. Pokemon, what was your starter? Starter Pokemon. Pikachu, right? No, you can't. It was, it was, oh, you couldn't have yeah, Pikachu. Yeah. That's right. It was. Unless you played Pokemon Yellow. Well, let me let me guess. Or let me yeah. try and remember. <laughs> this is my quiz. Yeah, that we should have had a quiz. I for know. <laughs> um, it was. It's um Squirtle, mm -hmm. the turtle, yep. Charmander, the little dragon, and then um, Bulbasaur. Yeah. He looked like a little. A little frog. Uh, he was a pretty he sure. also kind of looked like a... He looked like an ankylosaurus. Yeah. He was like a dinosaur <laughs> a bit, yeah. frog with like a bulb on his back. Yeah. With a bulb. Yeah. Um, so yeah, your starter Pokemon. That's a real... That, think, this, is, this is a real personality test here. I know when they did like Pokemon... Is it Pokemon Go or the one where you're outside? Yeah. Like, okay, yeah. I think I started with Charmander. Yeah. Because I like... I think fighter. dragons. Like, yeah. It's cute. Um, I, he's not a dragon type. Actually. Actually. actually not a dragon type. Well, what so. is he then? Uh, fire and something else. <laughs> oh, okay. Fire and flying, I think. Okay, well. Actually. Actually looks like a dragon, but I guess he's not a dragon. He grows up into a dragon, though, right? Actually, it's not called growing actually. up. <laughs> it's called evolving. Uh, so, okay, here's one thing that messed me not messed me up, was surprising to learn. Uh, Charizard, you know, that big, huge, he looks like a big dragon, right? Yeah. He's only like 5'7". What? Yeah. He's shorter than me? Yeah. 
Yeah, he's a little guy. Oh. For a, you know, a, I could a be dragon. Him. Yeah, I could totally. I could take him. I'm going to put him in a headlock. <laughs> the headlock. Yeah, put him. A little Pokemon. Flush, put a, flush his head down the toilet. Okay, so Pokemon live in, like, balls, right? Mm-hmm. Pokeballs, yes. But, like, that's where they, li- like, they live? They spend all their time? Like, they don't they get to, like, play or run around so, or make friends? I don't know if it's ever actually fully gone into, but I believe they're, like, basically miniaturized and, like, kind of digitized in the ball. Oh. And basically the world inside is, like, much larger. It's, like, it's like an actual okay. play pen inside. I, I don't... All right. That, I, that, I might be might be mis- mis- like, mis- It sounds like animal cruelty. Well, I mean, they make them right. fight each other. I know, right? <laughs> what even are they? Are they animals? Does anyone know? They're, they're Pokemans, okay. as, my, as my parents would say. Yeah. Pokemans. Pokemans. Um, okay. So I've got, like, the white mm-hmm. laid down for the bill. I'm going to put white a white circle on his shoulder. I was actually thinking I would just paint the whole shoulder yellow. Would that be cheating? No, that's not cheating. All right. <laughs> I don't feel like drawing a circle. Yeah, drawing a circle would be kind of a pain. Yeah. Like, I haven't gotten to the skull. I probably won't get to it today because we've only got half an hour left. I know. Oh, my gosh. Yeah, and we still have two more segments. We do? Oh, my gosh. Don't we? Well, we haven't ended this poll yet. What do we have on our... This is our list. Oh, yeah. The 90s we did. Oh, okay. So we just need to end our poll at some point. We should probably end it... I don't know. At 1130. We got three yeah, minutes. Yeah, three minutes. So let's end our poll and then we can talk about it. Um, so if you haven't voted in our poll, do so now. Yeah. We are fighting for the music that defined the 90s. It looks... Pretty firmly. Pretty far one way, but still, there's only 46 votes. Mm, come on. There's people. room. There's room to There's change room. it. Yeah. You got two minutes left. Uh, Pez. Bonus 90s nostalgia. Beavis and Butthead. Yeah. Started in 93. I loved Beavis and Beavis Butthead, and... but I never caught it. Oh, uh, yeah. It was always it was, it was only on MTV, right? Yeah. I didn't really care for uh, MTV at the time. I just... Like, I liked when I would catch um, actual music videos. Yeah. And like Beavis and Butthead, I like Daria. Yeah, Daria. But I I was way more into Nickelodeon. I was yeah. just like, I'm watching Nickelodeon. Yeah. I don't watch adult sh- like channels. Yeah, hey, I'm gonna watch Randy Stimpy. Forever. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> um. I'm gonna attempt a little yellow stripe here or yeah. red stripe because he's a red stripe in the picture. I don't know how well it's gonna go because I'm painting over a gloss. So it's a little difficult. Mm, this is like pull up weird. Yeah, it just doesn't. I hate that. Yeah, it doesn't sit super nice. Uh, Rudy says, "Image hand puppet Ubi." What is that? I don't know. I think he's trying to figure out who, what your puppet fear was. Maybe. Oh um, my. <laughs> I'm not sure. Uh. Somebody Google that phrase. Yeah. <laughs> Tell us. No, so th- there's another thing that did scare me, uh, also scared me, oh, was okay. Nickelodeon things, and there was a disembodied eyes and mouth. That is not what I'm talking about, though that is horrifying in itself. Wait, what ha- What was this? Uh, I, don't, I don't remember. So they would have these, like, in between commercials yeah. and in between the show, they would have these, like, interstitial things. Are you talking about Nick Jr.? Like, with no, the no. face? It was just called Face. No, 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 not that. Okay, okay. Although that is, that's a memory that you just unlocked. It's just face, <laughs> yeah. Um, no. Yeah. It was kind of like that, though. This was, like, kind of horrific. Uh, I'm going to have to post these up. And, I know. Because people have to, are going to be like, what is he talking about? We're going to have to go find all these yeah. things, yeah. Let's see. Glory, yeah. <laughs> Soups. Yes, the horse gets it. Uh, Demolition Man is my 90s movie from Cody Bernard. Oh, yeah, that's a good one. That's a good one. Oh, somebody said Mrs. Doubtfire right before it skipped to the bottom. (laughs) (laughs) Um, I'm trying to find it again. 11.30. I think it's time to end this poll. Time to end the poll. Let's see. Yeah, great. So we are kind of caught up. 
Let's end it, and it ends with grunge rock, which doesn't surprise me because it took a real <laughs> took a pretty firm lead, lead right yeah. in the beginning. Um, I I like grunge rock. I was I was into grunge and alternative in the '90s. My favorite yeah. band was the Cranberries, which isn't <laughs> grunge, um, but it's like the same realm. Right, similar. Yeah, yeah. You know, I don't feel too bad about it. Grunge is there's there's a lot of good '90s grunge. Yeah. And definitely, like, is the feeling of the era, I think. Mm -hmm. I think you kind of get this. I'm going to do some metallics. Yeah, go, go for it. Before I run out of time, I need this white to dry so I can cover it with yellow. I'm going to do yellow glaze. Uh, that's, yeah, well, you want to paint? That's too bad because we have a segment. Oh, boy. <laughs> uh, what fan is it time is, for? Actually, fan stuff is going to be in. Oh, we have a little bit of time. I'm sorry. I lied. You have. You have you have nine minutes to paint. Yeah, <laughs> I can do it. Zach Pfeiffer, what? Uh, I said his whole name. That's weird. Yeah. What '90s media aged the worst? S tapes. <laughs> oh my god, cassette tapes. Yeah. yeah, anything on tape just was so much worse than what had come out before it. Yeah. Yeah. What a bad idea yeah, that was. Uh, I don't think that's what he actually meant, though. No, it's mm. not. That's all right. I like messing with him. 90 stuff in general. It's like, uh, you go back and it's like, wow. we Very hit or miss. Yeah. Um, Age the worst? Media. That's like a really weird question. Let's see what chat says. Yeah, chat, what do you think? Like, zip disks. Soup says zip disks. Yeah, that's pretty bad. Oh, magazines aimed at teen boys, young men have not aged well. Also at teen girls. Yes. Like, I had, I had posters of Jonathan Taylor Thomas on my bedroom <laughs> ceiling, <laughs> and I was a little kid, and it's he was a little kid. Yeah, that's a little weird, odd. right? <laughs> Ooh, yeah. I didn't do anything with it. I just okay. it was just there. Like that's what you did. You just hung pictures of boys, yeah, like or girls, whatever, right? Um, I. I, I don't know how I feel about it. And as yeah. a parent, I, I'm not a parent, but like yeah. if I were a parent, I'd be like, like well, eh. at least it's not porn, I guess. Yeah. I don't know. I don't know what to say about it. It's a little odd. It's a little odd. But hormones gonna hormone, you know? Yeah. But yeah, the magazines are a little dark, I think. Magazines. Like sexualizing these young actors yeah. and actresses. I mean... Part of me wants to say, yeah, it's a good thing we're past that. We're not. But we're not, so. No. Well. <laughs> Just the magazine part is, Yeah. You know, it's kind of goofy. This is the part that's aged kinda out. Kind of weird. Yeah, exactly. Oh my gosh, more from Rudy. Rudy, you're a king this this morning. Um, 90s hip hop. Unity. Queen Latifah. Unity. Cream. Wu-Tang Clan. Yeah, Wu-Tang. Sabotage. Yes, by yeah. the Beastie Boys. Hard Knock Life. Jay-Z. Jay-Z. OPP, Naughty by Nature. <laughs> the Rain. I love that song. Oh, great. Oh, Missy. Are, yeah. Missy, you're See, so great. how did grunge... My I name is... I know. <laughs> it was... How is it... It's not that, it's, that it won. How did it win by such a large margin? I know. <laughs> know. Hip-hop and, and rap was so big. That's like primo. Yeah. Zach, uh, Pokemon, follow I Dream of Genie rules. Everyone knows this. Barbara Eden, first and still most powerful Pokemon. Okay, Zach's just gone off the rails. I don't know what he's saying. But Zach has a major crush on I Dream a Genie. Oh, really? Yeah. Yeah, I, uh, one year he got to pick out our costume. Well, we, we take turns every other yeah. year. And he got to dress me up as Genie, which I guess was fun for him. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Wait, what did he dress up as then? He was, we did like 60s shows, I think oh, is what I it see. is. Yeah, and so he was the captain of Gilli from Gilligan's Island. Right. Yeah, and then um, one of our other friends dressed up as Gilligan. Oh, that's good. Yeah. Uh, All right, I'm going to try and redo these. <laughs> I'm having a little trouble Oh, yeah, books. <laughs> oh, yeah. Those Soup said, on the ceiling? <laughs> <laughs> Did you have, like, posters of girls when you were growing up? No. I Remember, I was a very small child at the time. I mean, I know, but when you hit that age. Uh, right? No, I, so think, they, I feel like that was, like, kind of out of fashion. 
We had internet. That's true. You could hide <laughs> your... Yeah, um, my shame. Your, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I was really turned on by the voice of Simba. Oh, uh, yeah. <laughs> That's a great 90s movie. Yeah. Okay. Um, we only have a little bit of time left today. So if you yep. guys have any last minute burning questions or comments, don't forget to add us. We are caught up. It's a miracle. Yeah. Um, and take advantage of this super chat special while it's still here. Because like we said, we did hit 4,000 hours. We we're yes. just waiting for, for the YouTube email. To, yeah, for you to, to do. say Get its act together. All right. um, and if you haven't liked and subscribed yet, please do. Yes. And then go find five of your friends or enemies, doesn't matter, and have them do the same thing. Yeah. Uh, Let's see. I'm going to add some more metallics back here. Although I don't know if it's accurate. <laughs> <laughs> um. Uh, Oh, yes. Yes, I love all this stuff. Rudy, okay, yeah, 90s R&B, Waterfalls, great yes, song, perfect, classic, yeah. yes, Always Be My Baby, yes, yeah. I remember that. Say My Name, Destiny's Child, yeah. Ready or Not, The Fugees. Oh, oh that's Fugees. a great one. Yes, Remember the Time, Michael Jackson. Yeah. No mm. Ordinary Love by Sade. Yeah. He's on it. <laughs> Zach, yeah, but you can't put the internet on your ceiling. <laughs> <laughs> True. Um, friends. Soups is saying friends did not age well. Uh, is what it because think? of the type of humor or just because it was never funny to begin with? I know, right? <laughs> I never liked friends. I don't get it. It's all about Seinfeld. Seinfeld. I like that. Much better. I like that mean humor. Yeah. <laughs> yes, I like very cynical. I do. I do. Yeah. I love the office and i love seinfeld yeah um i know i'm so mean-spirited the 90s was very mean-spirited yes. in its humor i some of you may know this um i have a podcast with my friend kate and we cover horror movies and um we went back and watched scary movie oh dur god dur during that during our comedy uh. season and both of us were like this isn't a comedy <laughs> this is Horrible. That might be the worst aged media <laughs> from the 90s. Yes. I think that's it, actually. Yeah. There's, like, there's like a reference to, a, like, a, 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 like, a Nike commercial. Like, that just, oh, my. That's, like, maybe the least offensive thing, too. What's up? Oh, my God. <laughs> the Budweiser box. Yeah. yeah, that movie was, like, I mean... Yeah, made fun of everything. Like, yeah. I, I meant to put a picture of, like, Cartman in yeah. our slideshow because, like, 90s humor is yeah. just not nice. No, it's pretty mean-spirited. Yeah, and um, you might catch that. Like, you might catch that in, like, undercurrents with me and Zach, yeah. right? Like, because it's what we grew up with, right? We're trying to... Yeah. You try to get away from this stuff as you get older. But um, it's very mean. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I was constantly afraid of being made fun of. Constantly. <laughs> It's living in fear. Yes. <laughs> oh, God. Uh, yeah. Uh, my aunt. Clueless. So good. Let's see. Um, Holly. Ahem. Wet pet San Pablo. Come on, oh Saray. You didn't get that jingle stuck in my head today for nothing. I don't know if we could... I don't know if we could play that song, but... Can, can you hum it? Uh, it would not do it justice. Okay. Maybe I'll put that in Discord as well. Okay. We have uh, so much to put in yeah, Discord. Yeah, there's a lot. Out and today. Spotify. And, <laughs> yeah. Uh, yeah, so probably not too many Bay Area locals, but there was a pet store uh, that had their own jingle, like their own commercial. Okay. And it was truly awful. Yeah. They tried really hard to rhyme dogs and scorpions. What? And they butchered both of the words to oh make it gosh. work. Oh my gosh. Yeah, I want to hear this. Scorpions. <laughs> what? Uh, yeah. So whenever <laughs> I hear, try. so whenever I hear someone say scorpions, I always think scorpions. That sounds like something I would do while trying to make a pun. Yeah. Because I'm just it's so not, yeah. It's not good. No. Oops. I keep smearing my paint. Sorry, he's gonna be so upset. Yeah. Okay. Um, 
I think this is still around, but I'm like down in LA. It was keys, 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 keys on Van Nuys. Just like car sales. Oh, no. Uh. Like, I remember all these jingles. <laughs> I don't know that one. No, you wouldn't. Okay. Uh, I'm going to, we're going to do fan stuff. Oh, it's time. It's time. It's time. Uh, Great. I'm going to make a little mix here, but fan stuff is right here. We're doing it. Wahoo. All right. Boomstick. Boomstick. Uh, super cool ad mech. Um, th I, I love this the color weathering. scheme. The weathering. Oh, I know. Great. This, like, almost, like, enamel white. Yeah. With this, like, red super nice and the rust streaks. Uh, yeah, I love it. This is, I'm probably going to do something similar. I, actually, I'm curious, Boomstick, if you're here, can you let me know what your white recipe was? Because I want to do something similar when I do some alternate schemes for Nurgle. And, like, because this white just it's is so perfect nice. for weathering. It's like a cream. Yeah, it's like a, it's like, I'm, I don't, yeah, I want to get as close to, to pos as possible with it, though. When I saw this, I was like, oh, this picture makes me want to paint, a mich like, something mechanical. Yeah. I like this, um, I don't know what this airplane Ar airplane thing is. Archeal it looks like a, or yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, ornith it looks like an ornithopter. Yeah, I was going to say a rip-off ornithopter. Yeah, <laughs> I love it. A little bit of uh, Da Vinci in there, too. Very um, inspiring to me, anyway. All right. Uh, oh, sorry. I've got to hit the actual image slideshow. All right. Sidric Cody. Uh, cool <gasps> painting. Yeah, this. Oh, I love this. Yes. Super cool. This is Kingdom so Death, much. right? Yes. Yeah. This, this might be, okay, so I, we've been talking a lot of Kingdom Death in hobby chat recently because... Yeah. Um, Cody's been working on Kingdom Death yeah. so heavily. And when I saw this, I was like, this, you sold me. Like, yeah. I want to play this game. I want to paint these models. We're There's going to be some pinups in this list, too. Yes, I've seen. Which I'm very excited about. <laughs> this guy, I'm like, I don't even want to paint it because I love Cody so much. <laughs> I just want to, like, live vicariously through his model. Yeah. It's an amazing oh, model. It's so good. Amazing paint job too. So much going Such on. Such good work. I think the worst part about it are those hand feet, though. <laughs> <laughs> so creepy. The hand <laughs> it's like feet. Worse. I was thinking the hand butt. Yeah, the hand. Maybe the worst. Is that a butt or a vagina? Uh, I think it's a butt. That looks like a clitoris to me. I'm I'm talking about the back. Oh, the back. Oh, <laughs> there's the, yes, hands. there's both. That's right. I, <laughs> okay, so we've got all the anatomy covered here. Yeah. Kingdom Death, you know, yeah, they're a little more uh, yeah. willing to, you know, go out there. Go out there. David T. Four thirty three. This is some Tau stuff. I don't, I don't know I what that. exactly. Oh gosh. Because <laughs> I don't uh, remember anything. These are ghosts from Halo. Is that what they're called? Uh, no, <laughs> I don't actually. Promas. Uh, uh, I don't know. I don't remember what they're well, called, but they look great. Yeah, it's another good white. Scheme. Yeah. Yeah. Nice weathering. Yeah. Again, nice weathering. Look how cute the little towel are in their little ships. <laughs> it's like Luke Skywalker. Yes. Yeah. Thank you, Soup. Yes, I'm pretty sure these are piranhas. Thank you. Fugs, we can't get demonetized for saying body parts. Those aren't bad words. Come on now. Be, uh, we're, we're, uh, <clears throat> we have healthy, healthy views on the human body here. Yes. At the Hobby Collab. With the butt hands, yes. <laughs> Here we go. Here's a pinup. Yeah. Drax is our friend. KK. I'm outing mm -hmm. his name. <laughs> yeah. Actually, that's not even his name. Uh, Drax, yeah, also has been kingdom deathing it up. Yes. And I, you know what? You're right. KK, you you called it. This is what we should be working on. <laughs> <laughs> I love these pinup models so much. I really want to, I'm going to push for us to do a pinup stream. I want to yeah. get a bunch of these. We can all dress up in pinup. It'll be lots of fun. Holly will love it <laughs> to have you dressed up in pinup. In the pinup. Ooh, yeah. sh should I go for a... I think I'll go for a sexy cowgirl look. Heck yeah. With my... Uh, yeah. Anyway, that's stuff to think about in the anyway, future. Anyway. <laughs> but I just think he did such a lovely job. I love the skin. Yeah, the it's skin... Like purpley. Well, it looks like there's blood in it, yeah. right? Like a, a pro big it's problem real. painting skin is that, like, people forget how... Mm -hmm. and it's like stuff, it, it's almost, skin's like slightly translucent right. actually, so there's a lot of stuff that shows through. You can see everything. And so, 
Yeah, this looks awesome. Amazing. KK, thank I you. I love it. Yeah. All right, Sweet Sweet Nights by oh, Fostile. Yeah. Fostel? I I was pronouncing F Hostel, but F -hostel. I don't know what's right either. So F we can H just say hostile. whatever we want. But look at that purple. Look yeah, at, it's like glowing. It's super. It's a, I'm pretty sure it's airbrushed, right? So you've got some like airbrush shadows. It's yeah. super well done, and the um. It's incredible. Same thing. Like we don't you don't have a great view of it, but the the uh, hazard stripes. Also looking super good. Yeah. I'm curious about this. It was hard to choose a picture. Yeah, it's hard to. Also, just a great color scheme. Purple, mm -hmm. gold, and white. Very Cla like, yeah. regal looking. Yeah. Big fan. All right. Yeah, good work. Hey, Flannel Crocodile. Flannel, Flannel was worried about his base yeah. on this. And everybody was like, what are you talking about? The base is great. We love it. Mm-hmm. Yeah, it's All looking looking good. I'm digging the yeah. tank trap. <laughs> it's yeah. very cool. Um, yeah, just awesome base, awesome model. Curious what, is this Dark Angels or is it Salamanders, though? Or is it your own personal chapter? You should let us know. Oh, um, yeah, that part I don't remember. Yeah. Um, he was also trying out pigments. Yeah, the pigments the was, yeah. Um, so what, what, I've actually never done pigments. That could be a good <laughs> episode. Oh, yeah. Um, what, what is that? How does that work? So pigment... Are, well, pigment powders is usually what people use, um, and it's just uh, okay. Well, that's kind of hard to explain. It's it's pigment, <laughs> right? <laughs> I, I know what pigment yeah. is, but how do you use it? So what, usually what you'll do is, in, in the case of like a base, you'll take some, you'll spread it on the base, and mm -hmm. just kind of spread it out, and it, get, it makes it this um, really dusty look. It's really it's pretty much impossible to replicate with paints because it's so matte. Yeah. Um, I was actually going to use some today. We just kind of seem like we're going to run out of time. But um, <laughs> yeah, a little bit. Yeah. I know. But yeah, it's it's great for weathering. It gives a pretty unique, super matte look. Mm -hmm. So is that being used on the base here, or the actual panels, like the the armor? And so you would use it on the base. Okay. Well, generally. Um. And so, but but something you can do is if you want it to look like it's been in, been in the environment, is you can thin it down. Um. Usually, I would do it with mineral spirits. Or like white spirits. Okay. And um, you can run it into the recesses and it'll make it look like dirt is kind of caked up into it. Okay. Yeah. We'll have to try that out. Oh yeah, I see it. it look, yeah, it looks dusty. It's cool. Okay. Let's All do right. the next one. Ooh, okay. All right. This is by Kurt the Viking. Um, he did include like what it is yeah. down at the bottom. It's a little hard to read, but... So I was going to say, Sisters of Battle, not not, not right. Sisters of Battle. This is Nuns with Guns yeah. from Infinity. Infinity. Uh, look, super cool. I like the the variation in, like, the faces and yeah. um, ethnicities and stuff yeah. going on here. Very cool looking. Yeah, it's like, it's like, well, you know, I don't want to make everything about 40K because this is, this is its own game. <laughs> But it's almost like if you mixed Tau and Sisters of Battle, that's kind of kind of the look that I'm seeing here. Okay. Yeah. But yeah, uh, Infinity is its own thing, so we shouldn't always compare them. Have you played Infinity? <clears throat> I have not. I've heard it's good though. Yeah. Um, Flannel slash Pat says it's salamanders. Yes. Okay. I thought so, but I wanted to make sure. Okay. Look, you chose the best uh, chapter, so. Well. Uh, yeah. All right, Minnie Mayer, awesome yes. uh, Terminator librarian uh, from the the new shusher. box. Yeah, yeah, his own. Yeah, he's he's a different kind of shusher. <laughs> He'll shush you. Yeah. He'll right shush into you, the next life. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Shush you for the final time. <laughs> uh, yeah, it's looking great. I love yeah. the um, I love the the this like bone color you've got mm -hmm. going. I'm curious if this is Deathwing for uh, Dark Angels. So I'm seeing some white and red, which is usually what you see with uh, Deathwing. But if not, let me know. It could also be like Tome Keepers, maybe. Uh, yeah, it's looking great. Also, digging the purple Yeah. and the blue, little bits of purple and blue in there. What I really loved about this one is that recess, that red recess. You know, I'm like all about this like recess yeah, thing. Yeah, this panel um, liner. So it's like such a nice, it gives it such a nice look. Yeah, looking super, yeah. super cool. Classy. All right, let's do Yeah, good job, Minimare. Ooh, Molecule. 
man. Yes. This is looking, every time I, I see know. it, it's like getting better. I, I don't think it can get any better, but it just keeps getting better it and does, better. yeah. More of this like velvety looking. Yeah, that stippled look, finish. right? Finish, yeah. It's so lovely. Yeah, I'm curious, uh, you know, are you basing this off of the uh, uh, Richard Gray tutorial? Or is this, are you doing your own tutorial? Because it, it very much has that feel. Mm-hmm. Uh, be, you know, whether or not you are, you're really nailing the, uh, yeah. that, that look. Um, yeah. and it's looking super, super solid. Beautiful. I'm, the last time I seen it, there hadn't, the weathering hadn't been done on it. So mm -hmm. I think that's looking super good. This looks like, this looks like, like a grown up ultramarine. <laughs> like, cause it's not like bright blue, right? Like right, 90s right. blue. It's like subtle. Uh, it looks like mature. Like it's mature. It's a mature. Yeah. It's a... Uh... I, I enjoy it. Yeah. Well, let, actually, I'm, I am curious what chapter it is, if it's just your own custom thing. Yeah. Just doing it for fun. True. It may not be ultramarines. Yeah. I was just assuming because it's blue. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Very much. This, yeah. There could be Crimson Fist as well. But Yeah, anyway, let us know. Please. And Umi's daughter made it. Oh, yeah. His five-year-old daughter painted uh, Krondus. Yes. Look at how cute it is. And she did the base. The base is really Yeah, nice. and she picked all the colors. That's what great. a fun um, father-daughter project. Yeah. Umi. Good. good. Yeah. Umi's daughter, sorry. Yeah, not you, Umi. Yeah. Yeah, you <laughs> good job to your daughter. Yeah, to your daughter I hope she gets job. to see that her art made it up on stream. Yes. Yeah. Great colors. Amazing base. You should go mm -hmm. see the other pictures. There's there's a bunch. It's uh, super, super cool. It looks like she had fun yes. with this dragon. And and it was done so quickly. Yeah. Yeah. Great job, Umi, daughter of Umi. <laughs> <laughs> Tiny Umi. Little Umi, yeah. Rudy. Rudy shared. I, he said he was working, did these with his brother. Oh, sick. Yeah. Some space wolves. Yes. I really like this one. I, I like... Wolves. The uh, mix of like the fur with the metal. Yeah, I'm. I think they still do that, right? The yeah. models still show stuff like that. Yeah, they 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 still uh, have that kind of look tone. Yeah. Um, but this is like an older one, right? This is an older model. Yes. Yeah, it looks cool. It's super cool. Yeah, I, I love like I love some well painted this space wolf so angry. Yeah, uh, space marines. They, I get it. They have emotions, but After angry is, is mostly the that's that's the main one. Yeah, their fallback. All right, let's do the next. Rough house. Rough house. Ugh, so many pictures of this. Super cool OSL. This is a chaos rhino. Yeah. Oh no, chaos v uh, vindicator. Um, I think yes. Okay. Oh well, yeah yeah yeah. This is the one with the super cool uh, bulldozer <sighs> on the front. Yeah, and I, I had a hard time picking a picture, like a good picture, because there's there's so many good angles on this thing. Yeah. And I wanted I wanted to highlight the OSL, and also if you look behind the OSL, there's this like purple head. Yeah, just popping out. With of the... like a handful of lenses. Yeah, this is gross and a, and a horn. Yeah. <laughs> um, very cool, weird stuff sticking out of this yeah. tank. Very chaotic. Um, but I loved it, and so you should definitely go check it out in our Discord. Yeah. To get all the other angles because I, I couldn't, I couldn't choose get, all of you them. Choose all of them. Yeah. Yeah. Looking super good, Rough House. All right. Who is this? Laura. Teeny Tiny Victories. Hey, oh, Laura. Laura. Yeah. Yeah. Love all these little orcs. Oh, yeah. They're great. And the rainbow helmet. What a nice touch. Yes. That From takes... the Rainbow Warriors. Yeah. Look, I didn't know Laura had beef with Louis Sugden. I don't know what's I going know. on there. Jeez. Uh, you hate to see drama. And, huh? It's so much 40K <laughs> drama, yeah. Yeah, you hate to see it. But uh, apparently she's, she's expressing it on her face here. <laughs> no, seriously, it looks uh, it's super great. cool. Love yeah. the models. Super awesome paint job. Um, and the, the base is super, super neat. Like, mm -hmm. a lot of detail packed into those bases. Yes. Uh, she loves doing bases. And uh, I, I like how she includes all these, like, little flowers and stuff. Yeah. It's, the flowers are super cute. You know, those those extra steps go a long way. Yeah. Yeah, super right. cool. We've got one more one today. More. And this Tim. is Timbit. This Titan uh, watch. Yes. Is uh, that happening right now? Over. I, I think so. I believe it is. Yeah. Uh, That's fun. It looks amazing. Uh, Tim, I love it. So Tim's good. Stuff. It's yeah. always beautiful. Super cool. Thank you for the hearts. Yeah, however, it's not finished. Uh, yeah, because, yeah, but I... 
I, I love the OSL on this yeah. thing. Um, that was what I really wanted to highlight. Yeah, super well done. I'm curious. Uh, oh, never mind. No, yeah, it's 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 super well done. Uh, he 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 asked if he should add um, some additional markings, mm -hmm. and I said yes, so he has to go back. <laughs> <laughs> no, uh, never ends. Yeah, it, it, the the work's never finished. So honestly, we might see it again because I'm really curious about because I imagine he'll put. Uh, uh, the scar. They have these yeah. like David Bowie looking markings. Oh, okay. Um, and I, oh, I really okay. want to see it. So. That'd be cool. Uh, All right. That was our fan stuff. That's fan stuff. And we are at the end of our stream. Yep. We have four minutes left. Yeah. <laughs> so if you want to get any uh, last. This is your last chance. Yep. Oh, what is it? cool, What? Yeah. <laughs> Give me last minute questions, comments. 90s related things. Yeah, Let us know. You've got about 30 seconds. Yeah. Um. So I am. I'm not finished, but I got the majority of it done. Yeah. I'm mm -hmm. not quite finished either. Yeah. There's a little bit of lining I can still do. I I want to try adding some glow to the eyes. Yeah. All the little the little things. The little things, and then I need to do my freehand on the shoulder pad, but um, I'm just cleaning up a couple things, and then we I can put mine on the glam cam. Yeah. How's yours looking? So, uh, I haven't done any weathering or anything like that. But oh, I've right. got most of the base coats down. I think we have, what, I'm going to have, have a pretty good idea of what we're going for, even if it's not quite finished. Yeah. And, uh, yeah, when I put on the glam cam, I can maybe explain what else needs to be done. I actually might even start some of it now. Uh, so, yeah, I've got to do, you know, I haven't done any edge highlighting or anything like that. Yeah. But... Uh, those are things that are going to get done mm -hmm. off screen, mm -hmm. off stream. How did you guys do? Anybody who was hobbing along, um, how was your progress today? Yeah. Let us know what you were working on. I feel like we should ask in the beginning, but. That's all right. And um, we can throw our Instagram reminder. Oh, yeah. Go ahead and we're going to post these on Instagram when we're done. And we'll start a little, a little train. Yeah. Ask you guys to post yours if you've if you've done any we'll have you add yours to our little story train yeah um we want to see them yeah oops i gotta mix this zach's like why aren't they done yet <laughs> yeah like, come on <laughs> test this really um cold. stacks tell me what you think of the hero forge models i've generated so far oh oh wait we have a we're actually pretty far but we gotta okay we got we might run over a little we're bit. we're not gonna get to everybody yeah <laughs> unfortunately yeah. but yeah stacks love those they're super cool oh my gosh i'm so excited um yeah so you guys are painting those and sending uh, them or what's going on there are we gonna print them, we, and paint uh, them i don't know yet but they're really awesome and we should figure out a way to get them painted yeah yeah either way like no matter how it happens yeah uh we need to get these guys and then let's go with maybe our last one of the yeah. day Super Edie says, just yeah. a shout out that a bunch of us should hang out in Hobby Hang uh, on the Discord afterwards. Uh, yeah, we should. I agree. I think we're going to take a break and have lunch. Yes. Um, but I, we'll probably hop in. I, I know you have a trek home. Yeah. But um, yeah, Zach and I will probably hop in. I'd like to finish this Marine today so I can move on. Uh, we've missed a bunch. Do you just want to quick what, knock these out real fast? Any you think we can get. Yeah, real quickly. Like, okay, yeah. It happens. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, Captain Mannering, uh, no, that's not for us. Stack says, I am here because I need cheering up because I missed my nephew's oh. fourth birthday party in a row. He's four. Oh, sorry, yeah, Stax. Yeah, I'm sorry. It's a bummer. Yeah. You know. Hopefully he won't remember. <laughs> uh, yeah. Well, yeah, you can always make it up to him. Here's, here's where Meg's at, uh, with her raptor in blizzard camo. Yeah. It's so cold. Yeah. Burr. <laughs> Look at that yellow. It's like glowing on yeah. the screen. I think it's just our monitor. Yeah, I need to do some panel lining. I need to do the freehand. I want to do a little more glowy eyes. And then the gun is actually like an ivory color. Yeah, weird weird choice there. So I need to do that too. But I got it mostly done. I'm pretty happy with it. Like, he's cool. He's covered in spots. Yeah. I like it. You can throw mine Take up here. You While you're doing that, I'm going to knock out one or two. Mini Mayor yeah. says, Blood Angels, never like the blue-red combo, so we want to do something different. Uh, 
That's fair. I kind of like the silliness. I think I mentioned that. I like the yeah. kind of weird Lux. Ayasa says, thank you for the kind of words. Excuse me. I just burped. <laughs> um, Molecule Kua says, yeah, it started from Rich the Richard Gray stuff. I stippled the first one completely and we started trying to make it. We should do that to, you know. Oh, yeah. Yeah. It's a really interesting, neat uh I would technique. like to do that. Yeah. Yeah. And uh, cool. That's, we What's are now that? caught up. Except for, we'll get to that right after. So here's yeah. where I'm at. Sorry. Here's my 90s Marine. Uh, you know, I'm pretty used to doing this scheme because it's how I've done my whole army, so it's, like, not super new for me. But, uh, so things I have left to do. I want to work on the meta a little bit. I need to do some recess washes. Uh, I need to do a little bit of highlighting on the black. Basically, edge highlighting and, uh, shading is what I have left. Nice. Yeah. But, Looks uh, great. Pretty happy I love his it. little red mohawk. Yeah, his little <laughs> red thing. Yeah. All right. Cool. I think we did it. We did it. Uh, yeah. We do have one more from Kaldorf. All right. Uh, Eight Mile, Dave Matthews, my later Niners. Oh, yeah. yeah. Oh, also, Corvus Belly, when? Uh, I don't know. What? <laughs> <laughs> That's a game. Oh, okay. Although, I, I would be super down to paint the models. I don't know about playing the game. Okay. But, yeah. We did it. We ran we a little bit a over, but... Yeah. Yeah. Well, that was fun. It was uh, fun. Thank you for uh, bringing this idea up. This is another great oh, yeah. uh, idea you had. Yeah. Well... Uh, I think that's it. So, Meg, you're going to say what we normally say, because I can't remember it again. It's something like, be kind to yourself, be kind to each other, and always be creating. Yeah, you got it. Oh, See I got it. See you guys later. Bye. <laughs> you got to hit end. Oh, yeah. Uh, bye. Bye. <laughs>